Test, test, one, two, all right, man. Hello, hello, hello. One, two, three, one, two, three. Ichi Nissan. <laughs> right? Yes. <laughs> oh, that kills. <laughs> yes. That kills. It doesn't kill. It's just showing my Nihongo Jozu. What is that? Nihongo okay, Jozu. No. My Nihongo <laughs> Jozu. What, what, what was that? What do you mean, what was that? <laughs> I've only heard you say bitches doko desuka. No, <laughs> I got a, don't, don't I got a new one. I got a new one. I got a new one. All right. Mongo, mongo. What? What does it mean? Tra- that's, translate. That's not, translate. Oh, I don't know. What translate. What translate. What M- mongo, say? mongo. What is he? What is he saying? Yeah, yeah. He what just said. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I was like, I'm gonna ask the more fluent dude. Yeah, I'm yeah, like, yeah, yeah. To the safe fish, uh, the, uh, the 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 thing that you can eat. Oh wait, both of them. So no, no, no. He's he's not even trying to say. I know what he's trying to say. I trying to say because what do you think you're saying? I yeah, it's the thing. What were you saying? It's that. It's whatever he said. What did you think it was? I went to Golden Guy and I got drunk, and an old old Japanese guy said he was a beggar for his job, and he asked me to buy him drinks because I'm a rich YouTuber, so I did. And then in exchange, he taught me a Japanese phrase. Okay. Mongo Mongo. Oh, did you go back to Golden Guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah I did. Yeah, I did. <laughs> I was like, I don't remember this happening. No, I, yeah, I went back. I went back. And uh, what, what did what did, he, what did he tell you that it meant? Level three, sorry. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> Top clearance. Yeah, level three, level three, sorry. level three. He's level three. With you, I think. Well, <laughs> uh, here's here's my theory. Okay. Go okay. menasai means sorry. Yes. yes. Mongo is a pig Latin version of gomen. Mongo gomen, right? You're anyway. Nihongo Jozu. You're, you're saying a very close word to something that probably uh, people would laugh at if they heard yeah, in Japanese. I do know what he's saying. <laughs> you, couldn't, <laughs> you couldn't even remember so, it correctly. Yeah, that's, that's like a, a slang or, uh, I mean, it's like, it's like, a, it's, like, it's like a phrase. I mean, it's like, gomen nasai, gomen, mengo, mengo. Oh! You didn't even pronounce it yeah, correctly. Yeah, yeah. You didn't even pronounce it half yeah, correctly. Don't I don't pronounce shit correct here, Connor, because I don't speak Japanese. I just, that's but fine. I just you, mean, do you, know. you try? Do you tr- fucking try? I don't like trying, but I do. I don't think you do. I do, but it's hard. I don't like trying. you into this studio right here in front of God and all of our friends, and you said, Mushi Moo. <laughs> that's because <laughs> I, was, actually, I was in a safe space garden. <laughs> this, is, this is not Mushi a safe Moo. space. Who said that? That's a lie. <laughs> it was, it was like, a safe why? space to practice. Like, just be, like, just fucking be normal. When yeah, I go to the 7 Eleven, I walk up and then they say words to me, and I yeah. go, no. Because I'm assuming they're asking if I want a bag. And then I say, Arigato gozaimasu. <laughs> and then I walk, okay. I walk my I saw, white ass I, out. I saw a tweet, and now it makes so much more sense. Somebody tweeted out, and I and I thought it was like, I was like, huh. It said, uh, Japan is Wakanda for white people. I feel like, <laughs> I feel like dude, you, you. I feel like you're mate. Now I'm starting to get it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. How many phrases did you come in armed with? Now? Like, what did you know coming in here? Uh, was it like uh, Arigato, uh, bitches, uh, doko desu? Yeah. Now? Yeah, I did come into those two. All right. Yeah. Okay. Sumi Masen. I've never seen Ludwig be like even like ten percent flustered, but it just you in Japan, you were so much more flustered and so much more uh, conscious. It's stressful. The only time I'm not stressful is when I'm getting drunk. That's the okay. only right. time that's where the same with Japanese people. Yeah. I know, and that's why I have drank every single night, yeah. and my body is breaking down. Yeah. He drank all night, and then we ate half the, all the McDonald's menu together. Yeah. Just Ooh. a couple how hours ago. How does it? Compared to the uh, American McDonald's, it's like menu. slightly better. Yeah, it's like yeah. like a little bit. It's like okay, the, the, uh, definitely not worth it. No, no, no. It's, it's still <laughs> shitty McDonald's. Hey guys, if you think it's, it's it's a little better than America, it's a little better. Yeah, but like a little. Like you're oh, still re- like is, like assigning. I will be a piece of shit today. I'm gonna go to McDonald's. He was he was out, bro. We we literally we got done with the stream. We just like have fifteen hundred calories of McDonald's in our belly, and then we just like sat on his bed on our phones, silent for an hour. It's not even kidding. That's literally what we did. I watched uh, I watched an isekai on TikTok. Yeah. Oh my god. Wait 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 wait. wait. Hold, so up, hold up hold up hold up for no, a second. Please, you're you're gonna explain. need to like expand on this, Dude, man. Okay. This is so okay. insane. TikTok is actually revolutionary. Right. All right. So you know how there's like clips of shows on TikTok? Mm-hmm. Yeah. It was it was like um you know that one hunter hunter song? It's like da na 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 na. It's like uh, the predator one. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. the epic oh, one. The meme yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. When yeah. You, when someone gets caught yeah. with a D's nuts yeah. joke. Yeah. So it's that song, and then it's a two minute clip 
of uh, like I got reincarnated as the strongest mage in the world. It's, it's you're, you're, you're gonna need to narrow it fucking down, man. That's literally every. <laughs> that's what? literally every isekai. Uh, <laughs> are you fucking with me? No, no, no. no, no. It's it. It wasn't good. My but fault. but what happened <laughs> is is that they uploaded that two minute clip with that like little meme to like get you hooked right. into the show, right. and then it's the first episode distilled into two minutes, and then if you keep watching it, it says auto playing next episode because it's a part of a playlist, and they have one two minute edit like that for every single episode in the season. Bro, and so I just went through the season in like half an hour. Yeah. This is this is like the new age uh watch Naruto sub one out of three on YouTube back in the day. Yeah. Do, do you remember this? Did yeah, you, yeah, did yeah. 100%. 100, yeah, yeah. It'd, like se- it'd be like seven minutes. It'd be like flipped. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah this yeah, is the, it's, the it's Zuma version. It's compressed. And I was, I was mad at it. I'm like, are you, that's just, why watch that in general? Yeah. And he's like, so I don't have to watch all of the show. It's like, well, why watch it at all? <laughs> yeah, you don't have to watch the show. Well, no, 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 yeah. because I, I want to be a piece of shit and scroll through TikTok. And I, it, like, look. If you watch an isekai, mm. you are wasting your life. No offense. Hey, hey yep. can we? Can we <laughs> <laughs> I can attest. I can attest. Actually, I- isekai. Isekai means. Wow. I'm not kidding. I'm not. Uh, weed. Okay. Oh, Nihonga okay. Jozu, isekai. <laughs> I'll let him explain. He's the expert. Yeah, you are the expert. Actually, I want you to explain. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Great. No, no I, let, me, let me let me see how much you understand. Yeah, I can I'm handle this. I can handle this. Yeah, isekai is an anime uh, genre that started with Sword Art Online where you get teleported to a universe that is not your own, oftentimes as like a super strong, powerful, you get every single bitch in the world, you got a harem, you're ripped, and then you go back to your real life sometimes and it sucks. It is Harry Potter and Isekai. Kind no, no. of. <laughs> no, no. We're, we are not getting into this. I, I can't believe you bring this up, man. I can't believe you bring Harry Potter into this. I, just, I feel a, like it's like it's like a modern no, version no, no. of it. It's, it's not, no. Harry Potter is in the same world. It's yeah. all the same thing. Easter okay. guy's also, way sadder than Harry Potter. Also, is, I'll be honest. is not the first Easter guy. What is the first Easter guy? There's been it, a lot before it. I mean, go I mean, I mean go it's, it's, it's dependent. <laughs> like, the genre is so wide that you can call. You can't even pick your own fights here. This is his dog. I'm out of this. I do not not watch these shows. Right. Sword Art Online was like the first anime that popularized the genre. Mm. But I mean, you could call Alice in Wonderland an isekai, right? Because they get transported mm. to another world, or it's basically whenever you get transported or reborn to another world, universe, okay. whatever. The genre definition is kind of like very broad. Mm. Uh, but now in anime, it's just a kind of genre for a lot of like trashy, very cheap anime. Power fantasies. Power fantasies. Like, I'm wondering if there's an American kind of equivalent to isekai. What? <laughs> no, Narnia, yeah. yeah, that's a good example. Except they're not powerful when they go; they're just fucking like, like yeah. Narnia. But if it was marketed towards like adults, if and, Narnia, but they go and then and all like the snow witches want to yeah. fuck them. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> so that's part of the power fantasy is like sexually irresistible. Mm-hmm. Yeah. For these shows. Yeah. 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 Okay. Because you, cause you know Weebs ain't getting as many girls as this main characters are, man. Right. And they're like, I, I can be in the Sword Art Online world, and then I can bust. You could bust. I could bust all day. I took a picture with Asuna in a wedding dress, and she was beautiful. Welcome back to the yard episode. <laughs> 80, 84, it's our 82. Our 100th episode. 82. Well, you guys have an intro Otherwise and it's been- Otherwise known as CN in mm-hmm. Spanish. Oh. We, we, you know, technically you have to have an intro to get nominated for an award I for podcasts. Yeah, yeah. What? Yeah, yeah you have to have an intro. None of us got nominated for any yeah. incredible award. Do you guys award. not have one? They don't oh. do intros. Yeah. You just get right yeah, into no, no, it. No, we do do intros. No, no, we, 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 do. we do intros. Not scripted, but mm. we say, hello, mm. welcome to Trash Taste. But no, we're not on Trash Taste That's right so now. That's so weird. Why would that be a requirement? I don't know. I just heard about it once in a Rooster Teeth podcast, and now I spread that information. Yeah. It could be wrong. It's, I spread like, a lot of misinformation. Like a rumor, you know. It's, it's, it's people watch your podcast and like, I just don't know what it is. It's funny there's some yeah, kind of intro like, to tell me what it is. <laughs> there's 40 about. episodes in and like, fuck, I wish I knew what I was watching. <laughs> what are we, this would be so cool. Who are these guys? <laughs> That'd be a scripted audio book. Yeah. <laughs> this is cool. You guys got a Japanese food hole on your on That's your table. That's not a food hole. <laughs> so, you know, this so is, you this is like a carryover uh, from, because we had a problem where we couldn't find just a square Table, uh, yeah, and they don't have those. And so, no. as you can tell, this is this is just two desks it's yeah. two that right? we've this just put like our, together. This is the beds in our hotel. We're staying at our hotel, and back. it's like, it's, well, oh, you don't want any food? I'm not. I'm not hungry either. I'm not hungry either. That's what the sponsor. And it's <laughs> and it's two beds, and it was like we originally go in there like this is the most big bed I've ever seen. It's actually two connected together secretly, and I was mm. like, is this common? Because it feels like shit in the middle. 
do not sleep in the middle. Yeah, it's it's very common in Japan. Uh, it's very rare that hotels will have uh, double beds. Yeah, they're always, oh, okay. they're always if, too even single. if you're a couple here in Japan, people want to separate the beds. Yeah. I don't mm, know why. Right? Maybe I mean, we we know why. Yeah, we we know why. Because yeah, <laughs> nobody has sex. Nobody nobody's intimate. Nobody's fucking. Nobody's no, intimate. nobody's fucking. Like, no, no, no. Okay, no. then why am I walking down the streets of Akihabara and they got signs for fucking everywhere? <laughs> well, it's not for double what? beds. <laughs> <laughs> You're conflating. Touche. That's, that's a, it's it's touche. only in like a one of those shitty little hot tub pools. Yeah. Uh, and, okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, we, nice. we once went on a camping trip, and there was this couple that went there on this camping trip. They had apparently used all their weekend just for this one camping trip, and they sat on two opposite sides of the camp, just not interacting with each other at all. Wow. And then uh, they go back and they're like, we had a great time. <laughs> yeah. like, I've never felt yeah, more close to you. <laughs> we got a lot closer. Uh, wow. Well, anyway, uh, we are on the Trash Taste set, but this oh, this is yeah. The Yard, episode 82. We're with Garnt and Connor. No, uh, Joey, because he could not uh, make it. Yes. And we will be cycling in the other Yard guys occasionally. So if that happens, don't freak out. If you hear a different voice, the, the, it's, we just swapped. We, but do we need out. to intro okay. every time someone else No, we'll in. just swap it without introing. Are and you guys keeping time, But we have way. Aiden and Nick <laughs> in a cage. Cage over there, they're in a cage, okay, yeah, nice. and we'll release yeah. them they're, occasionally. No, they're, they're actually, it's hanging, it's a go go dancer cage, and they're just they're, they're <laughs> yeah. gonna be so sweaty, yeah, like in Star Wars, and they're just doing sexy dances, <laughs> yeah. And uh, you look good, the Aiden, the you mm. look good, you look good, you look real hot. Okay, there oh, goes. wow, he's oh. taking it off, wow, he's taking off. His I shirt. got the cameras pointing at that. Um, uh, are you guys liking Japan so far? I am, yeah, but I have beef with you, reserved. Why beef with me specifically? I got beef with you, why? I got. A problem with you. I <laughs> also have beef with you because what? I'm with him, so I unfortunately okay, have right, beef okay, with right. you. Well, it's nice I'm... to see you again. It is nice to see I you again. I have so much beef with you, though. So I... shut, the, shut the fuck is up. Is it because I'm too helpful and I've been helping you? You've been <laughs> actually a massive help. Okay, you've right. guided me around to amazing <laughs> spots. <laughs> you've hooked me up in ways that I could only uh, bow like right. Slime does at a 7-Eleven <laughs> when he gets a coffee in the morning. this meme. It's not a meme. Uh, mm -hmm. but, mm -hmm. but you... When uh, we went to Akihabara yesterday, yeah. said you have to go to a specific spot yeah. called the uh, Culture Zone. Yeah. Yeah. So what I call the, my downstairs. What, 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 the, what the fuck was that about? Because we walk into that place, <laughs> mm -hmm. and we're walking around, and it's a lot of figures, and then we see this aisle with curtains, and we're like, <laughs> dude, that's going to be so sick. They have a cool secret section. And we walk in, and <clears throat> Connor, I shit you not, I saw a sea of children Tom Brady would love to kiss <laughs> naked. Wow. Just naked. <laughs> what, what, what is that? Well, uh, okay, so there, there are scarcely places in, uh, in Akihabara that have, I want to say, everything that encapsulates the area. Yeah. And that building has a little bit of everything for everyone. Uh, some, some, of, yeah, some yeah. of the they the even covered for everyone. EDP four four five. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. that's the thing. That's the other everyone. Mm. More often than not, we are too. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> I'm, okay, I'm, I'm kind of right. Yeah, I'm done with that everyone. Done. No, I obviously don't partake in those sections. But why are you I saying thought, it like you do? Secretly? I thought that maybe you know, as a tourist, you might want to see the kind of weird stuff that goes on. Um, I ran into like what I can only imagine is a Japanese high schooler there, and we locked eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, he shouldn't have been in that and, I, and I was like, bro, you got like, you gotta stop coming here. <laughs> <laughs> You're trying to, trying to shake and like, please just go live a normal life. Yeah, I, I got to ask, how long did you spend in there? Okay, 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 okay. Here we go. Okay, we go. So, so I won't, I won't, I won't leak who, but somebody in the group. So we're in there for like a couple minutes, and we're all in there. We're laughing. And we're like, this is ridiculous. And then someone finds something crazy. We're like, that's ridiculous. And like the way uh, porn works is that they blur the nipples in the vagina. Yeah. But buttholes are fair game. Yeah. So some are just like wide open buttholes with just come <laughs> falling out like a waterfall. Dude, oh my god. And I'm like, that's a crazy thing. I was and, not with them, by the way. I don't have beef with you after oh, okay, hearing okay. this. Well, that, yeah, I, I think. You're great, oh, thank and you. uh, you're weird. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> and so somebody from our group, in the absurdity of it, they're like, "Oh, because it's the craziest one." They take a picture of it, and I'm like, "That's a bad idea. You are just taking pictures of <laughs> child porn." I, and I that saw, is just, yeah, yeah. I would, oh. I would get it off your phone. One you of gotta get that off your phone. Yeah, that, also. I, <laughs> Oh, oh, it is oh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, of course, okay. of course, yeah. It is dry. Yeah. It is. Dry. It is, it is an anime store. Yes, yeah. yeah. It has. It has everything an anime store <laughs> yeah. want. So, so they had a curtain <laughs> in that curtain section that I didn't dare go so, in. So, to trans <laughs> to translate for everyone who's not uh, knowledgeable about mm. Japanese and anime culture, they went to the dojinshi section, which mm. yeah. is the part where you get a lot of fan drawn like books and art. Yeah, uh, dude, I thought dojinshi was chill because I used to. 
like <laughs> jerk off to Naruto Dojinshi because it would be that one that one wait, lady. Wait, 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 wait. What's Don't up? Say that. What's up? That's say you just okay, said. Okay, well, right, like that's bad. No, to that's say. chill. That's chill, right? Naruto Dojinshi chill. I wouldn't personally, but <laughs> he hasn't even seen Naruto, so he has he has no uh, horse he, in this race. He got no skin in the uh, game, bro. Yeah. Okay, so I think so. Maybe Dojins back then were more chill, but I think definitely over the past five, ten years, they've gotten progressively more intense. It doesn't have to be. Um, like child looking characters. It could just be adults, Christ. right? Uh, well, most of it's adults, but yeah. there are, unfortunately is a lot of child stuff. Uh, yeah, and, and, and unfortunately yeah. a lot of that is centered in Akihabara. Right. Uh, don't ask me why. I mean, we you, all know why, but you, don't you, ask you, me you why. You kind of realize when you're in Japan long enough, you're like, so what's with up? Uh, what's up with all that kids stuff? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, you're like, Wait yeah. A minute. yeah. It's yeah. weird. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, it's very odd. And a lot of people online like to be like, it's just a different culture. You don't get yeah. it. And it's like, oh. It's still okay to think it's weird. No, yeah. no, hundred percent, hundred percent. It is weird because <laughs> the, the the main question is who does this appeal to, and when you find out that answer, you're like, oh, well, this is weird. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean. It's, it's like, never yeah. like a good. There can't be a good answer <laughs> to that. Yeah, answer. yeah. No. And like you went to, I guess, like you went to like the culture zone, which is like kind of sad. It's literally like, called the culture, the culture zone. <laughs> yeah. Officer, Could I'm not, I'm, <laughs> yeah. I'm just cultured, okay? <laughs> Officer, it was in the cult <laughs> zone, <laughs> actually. Culture <laughs> falling out of my pockets, culture all over. Oh, but uh, the, I mean, there are some stores that are literally like seven stories high. Oh, I should take them to the porn store. Yeah, the yeah. porn store, it literally seven stories high. You saw that like, you know, like that one guarded section? Mm. Imagine that and extrapolate yeah. that to like seven stories. Yeah, shit, 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 shit. And uh, yeah, it's just, it, 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 if if you thought some of the things you found out in there were like messed up, mm. there are some, you haven't even, even seen like the sex toy <laughs> yeah, so, so you know wow. those, um, uh, I, I did a video where we bought each other a $500 box, right? And yeah. I try to get him as much messed up stuff that you could show on YouTube. Yeah. And uh, there's this one store where they sell all the types of different sprays. And I got you like the only ones that you could show, which is like two out of like 30. Yeah. Uh, where it was like armpit of an office worker. Uh, but it gets progressively a lot <laughs> oh, worse. Oh, <laughs> Dude, yeah. I, yeah. Get me in the lab with the scientist who's like, all right, this is an office worker sweat <laughs> yeah. versus like it's Uber the, driver. Yeah. Yeah. The meme of the template of this, the dude looking <laughs> yeah. at the science like, ah, yes, yeah. finally yeah. I perfected the sentence. Yeah. Uh, but that was in the store and that was in the section that was the, the tame section. Mm. And there is mm. a more, more often than not worse. Sections. What would the worst scent be? Um, I've uh, uh, okay, okay. Uh, like, I, I have actually say. been <laughs> there because my wife yeah. has, uh, let's say, reviewed a lot of the scents. She's the degenerate queen. She's the yeah. degenerate queen. Uh, I would say the worst scent I have ever smelt is probably uh, foot fungus. They made a foot fungus scent, and that's like a fetish. God. Yeah, Ooh, and that's, that's like a like cheesy yeah. feet smell. Yeah, and they they try they somehow have recreated this in the lab, and it's literally just like the Walter White meme of just like creating the worst <laughs> smell humanly possible. Mm. It's nasty. Um, it is nasty. They are they are pretty welcoming to fetishes and willing to cater to them here. Yeah, which is a uh, pretty intense. But which kind of goes against a lot of things. Don't sleep on the same side of a campground. No. Yeah, <laughs> that's, a, that's such an interesting like juxtaposition. I guess I don't know. Look, it's weird. It's I, weird. I have two thousand calories of McDonald's in me, so anything you say, it, it's cool, man. <laughs> I don't know. What does that mean? I, I'm, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I, what I'm saying, I might as well be drunk right now. Officer, <laughs> I wasn't in the culture zone. I just didn't know what was happening. Officer, I, I, had, had, I, had, I had so calories. much McDonald's. I don't even know where <laughs> I am, bro. Like, <laughs> oh. What? Yeah, you. I, I said what I said, bro. <laughs> uh, I had a fuck up. Okay. All right. I had a culture difference fuck up. Okay. So, like, most of I think, like, actual culture, and not like the culture. No, God, no. No, no, no. Like, I think most of the culture is very easy to catch on because everybody follows, uh, like, a lot of, like, I, what, like the rules, like, the for unwritten sure, yeah, rules sure. of, like, okay, you walk on the left side of the street, escalators, you stand on the left, walk on the right. Mm -hmm. yeah. like, all that I'm kind of picking up on, um, yeah. and, and that's easy enough. But the one thing I wasn't prepared for is I have a coffee shop I've been going to. Okay. And I like this coffee shop because the lady who works there speaks English. Okay. <laughs> English okay. Jozu. Okay. And so I went in there, and I was so nervous, and I was like, espresso. And she's like, <laughs> why do you say like Italian? Yeah. Espresso. No, wait, how do you, you say, say it? You say too. it. All right, espresso. No, no, no. Archie, play espresso. it back. Espresso. Espresso. No, Archie, play it back. Put an no, extra no, vowel no, no. in front of the vowel. Okay, how do you say uh, cappuccino? How do you say that? You want, to, you want a cappuccino? Yeah. Cappuccino. That's pretty, it's not bad, yeah. Uh, kiku. Kiku? Kiku? Isn't that the one that means th this? No. No, no. Cut it. Cut it. 
See, this is You've been this basically is saying, struggle. listen. Like, ano, cappuccino. Like cappuccino. 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 <laughs> cappuccino. <laughs> you Why'd you go Italian? Yeah. <laughs> Do you I think, think you're in Italy? <laughs> <laughs> is that what's been going on? I've been okay, trying okay, to get a Vespa. Carry on. Carry on. Uh, right. So, so I'm, at this, I'm at this coffee place, and I go there every day. Mm. Uh, and I had, like, a really cute interaction one of the days where, like, the daughter of the one who works there uh, was like talking uh, to her mom, and, and they were like, "Oh, we just went to L.A." I was like, "Cool, where'd you go?" She was like, "Disneyland." I was like, "Disneyland, that's sick." My girlfriend used to work there; she was a princess. And then the mom told her daughter, and she was like, oh, and she looked at me, and she was like, "That makes you a prince." And then she came up, and she gave me a little gift of cookies. Oh, yeah. and it was very, very sweet, yeah. very sweet. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then I go in the next day, uh, and we have like a rapport at this point. And and at the end, I just finished my coffee. We had a great chat. Mm. I'm about to leave. She goes, "Do you like snacks?" And I go, no, I hate snacks, bro. I get f- super fat. I don't eat snacks. And then she just looks really sad, and she goes, I got you these snacks. <laughs> oh. I was like, why, why do you have gifts on deck for me? Why, what do you think? Why do you think she was asking you that? I thought it was like conversation. No, like, Wait, this she is a little just, kid? She was obviously going to give you something. No, this is like the woman who owns oh, it. Oh, yeah, oh. yeah. Wow. She probably thinks she like went home and stomped that cookie as well. Like, yeah, threw it in the. She, she gave it to me. I was like, I was like, but these snacks, <laughs> <laughs> bro. Thank God. <laughs> I bet she was like up one night being like, I'm gonna give him the snacks, and she's gonna love it, man. He's gonna she, love she, it. She went out of her way to think about you. Oh, yeah. dude, that is crazy. Oh, I feel like a you piece of shit. Do I get gifts back? You can do that. What do you actually. give like a forty year old coffee barista? Ah, uh, well, uh, liquor. A, do you actually do you actually want to get her like a, a present? Should I? No, you don't. No, of course you don't. She keeps giving me shit. <laughs> she's, she's just being friendly. She wants to okay. come back. Like, right. In Japan, I'm sure you noticed this, right? There's a lot of uh, they really like a lot of local chains or sorry, local uh, like cafes or bars. They just build up rapport ex- and expecting you to come back a lot. Oh, it's so it's for your fun. business. Yeah. yeah, like you have your spot. So oh, happens. You, this is happening, right? you guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I have yeah. my spot. The, the guy, way you just said, oh, it's just for business. <laughs> it's not me. It's well, not it's, me. Right? It's also like a, it's nice to see. Like I imagine if oh, you're a business owner, yeah. you see the same. Customers. I thought it was like my <laughs> company. <laughs> <laughs> so American, you're like yeah. to make money. Right? <laughs> well, okay, you you know me because when we yeah. hung out in L.A., if I go to a place, I yeah. like tipping. It's mm. oh, tipping. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Who are you? I was gonna say he has a thing where it's like I know a spot, I know a guy, and it's like a fucking chain. <laughs> and it's, it's called like, Panera. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yo, yo, but hey, I did find a spot here. Y'all heard of Coco Curry? <laughs> yeah, Bro. we have that in LA. <laughs> Ichiran Ramen. Oh my god. Yo. Oh my god. All right, okay, go. All right. Uh, so I, I like tipping a lot, but you can't do it here. Yeah, you can't. Yeah, you can't. Yeah, here well, it's yeah. it's like they don't try for the tips. They try to get you like a regular customer. Mm-hmm. So like mm-hmm. a lot of people in Japan, they don't like to try new things a lot of the times. They like the comfort of coming back to the place and seeing a familiar face. You know, you can buy gifts though. You can. Okay. And when you like when we went out to Golden Guy, I was like, hey, if you if you want to tip her, you have to buy her a drink. Right. Which is kind of sucks because it's like instead of getting just a monetary amount that you can spend anywhere universally, it's yeah. like, all right, I just have to get liver cancer. Mm. Uh, <laughs> yeah. You know. yeah, yeah. Uh, it's, it's, yeah. It's, you have to damage yourself. Yeah, it's yeah, like it's yeah. like the loophole. You can't tip them with money, but you can buy them gifts, mm. right? Which they can exchange for money. <laughs> yeah, and often they're not, you know, because in Japan, right, it's like you don't know what the person likes, you know. Maybe they like doujinshis, uh, which you could get them. <laughs> Risky move. Risky I get like <laughs> 10 of them. <laughs> not, not going there anymore. Or, or most of the time, people just get like fruit or famous snacks from a local area. Yeah, or have, you, have you noticed it. how expensive fruit is here? Yeah, you kind of get yeah. the uh, Fruit's a big one. Why? Yeah. Why don't they mass produce it with cheaper labor in foreign countries? Let's excuse you, me, it's yeah. an artisan culture, actually. The you, fruit. you watch a video about yeah. like Tanaka who massages the melon every night before bed. Yeah. And that's why it's worth. I, I, I literally saw this I, video I, where I've been condescending, but it, often <laughs> no. it is there's so much like extra work. That, no, that yeah. actually you happens. Mean, you guys being so jaded, you see shit like that, and you're like, fuck's sake, dude, come on. I'm, I'm a hater. Man, I'm a hater it. on it. I too. mean, it's a fucking melon. I saw I saw this one video of this melon farm who obviously loves it craft but he put like newspaper wrappings around this melon so that the cracking on the melon was aesthetic and mm. i'm like i don't I, i'm sorry mm. i don't give a shit about the cracking of the melon like just make sure well, it, it tastes was the, good the 40 dollars strawberries you guys had and they were and, and, and immediately you asked were they worth it and they were like <laughs> no, no. <laughs> but it's, it's like it's like the cheap because everyone is like everyone knows how expensive fruit is right so if you yeah. don't want to get someone you just get them fruit Cause it's like, all right, you have to, you know, it's fruit. It's meaningful. You probably like it. Yeah. And it shows that like, I thought about something. Mm, mm. But yeah, yeah, I think when you live here for a while, you do become jaded to this kind of stuff. Cause you're, you're kind of like, well, you know, I just wanted an apple. Like I just wanted, <laughs> yeah. an apple. Like, I didn't, I, I didn't want the only option to be like a, a dude with a story. Yeah. And I get that that's, that's impressive and that's cool. And it's nice people are willing to go through that. But also I just want the fruit. 
Mm. Yeah. Well, I have a I have a hypothetical for you guys. All right. Okay. As, okay. as residents of Japan, I want to run through a scenario. Mm. I'm on a train. Okay. okay. Oh, I am a foreigner. He's already wearing like 15 okay. taboos. Can be <laughs> 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 I'm wearing an all white overalls uh, suit because I am a painter. That's okay. cool, right? Yeah, right? yeah. I think that's cool. That's cool. No, I, why would you... Do, you? do you think it's cool that he's painting? Do you think like, it's cool? Uh, oh. You're painting. Yeah, you're painting while you're wearing white I, overalls. I, I, I guess like, do you respect blue collar workers? I'm yeah. That's hurtful. I mean, <laughs> I, I, I don't mind what your occupation is, man. <laughs> yes. As long as you're chill. <laughs> it's, it's it's giving a, nepo, baby. Yeah, right. not, a, not a warm atmosphere. <laughs> okay, but I'm on the train. I have I shit my pants. Okay. What? I shit all is, is over this myself. A hypothetical? This is absolutely hypothetical. <laughs> <laughs> I I need help, and I'm just like, and I'm shitting my pants. What happens on the that crowded train? Do people try to help me? Absolutely not. No. <laughs> people will <laughs> call. People will call someone. No, uh, they won't. They won't. They, they will, what happens? Wait, wait, wait. What do you think watch. happens in America? I mean, if I'm like, help me, I've shit my pants. <laughs> They don't help you. You're, you're gonna be on, think, you'll no. be on TikTok within an hour, <laughs> yeah. and you will be going viral. I genuinely think someone on the light rail in Los Angeles would be like, "Come on up, soldier!" No, <laughs> no, no, they wouldn't. <laughs> What do you think? What do you think they do? They, they slowly take off your straps and they'd be like, let me see that ass. Let me get in there. They'd help you and then they'd pull out the tablet and be like, how much are you going to tip? Oh, okay. Turn it around. Yeah. But what happens in that scenario? People will just do nothing. Like, they would they try to ignore it? Uh, Probably yeah, as much as possible. 100%. Uh, unless it's rare to get a Japanese Karen or something. If someone sticks out here, Does people just that. try to ignore that person as much as possible, even if that person is in your face. Uh, and then they'll just complain about it afterwards. You tell me about the phrase. What phrase? A nail that sticks out is the one oh. that's first oh, yeah. struck. Yeah, yeah. The nail that sticks out is the first one that struck but, back uh, in. Other countries have this as well. Like I think Australia has one that's like the poppy that grows too tall gets cut or something. Tall poppy well. syndrome. Uh, yeah, and well, that allows yeah. you to roast your friends for yeah. being successful. Yeah, well. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you pointing at me? You're not Australian. <laughs> this is not relevant uh, to you. Oh, I'm not, am I? Dude, the, the episode you came on and did with us, people were mad that I did the uh, such bad accent. It was fucking awful. It was terrible. Oh, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I haven't heard, I haven't heard this <laughs> accent. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. No, I learned my lesson. Hey, People that video. Don't worry, just, he, just bow afterwards and I'll, it'll be okay. <laughs> <laughs> that video got a million views, so you did it something did. right. You're, you're, the episode with you on it is our first million view episode. Oh, it's shit, really? Yeah. Yeah. So, so crazy? pony up again. Wow. Pony up again, guys. All Come right, on. Right. Right. Cough made, it up. I made the yard. You can yeah. say that. <laughs> no, okay. yeah. You can say that. Well, now. now you're filming in like the Trash yeah. Day studio, so eventually it will just be like me, Joey, and Connor, and we'll just like take over your channel. And then the transformation will be complete. Yeah. You're like, I like this new it, set. Yeah, he replaced us all except Aiden, who's just still there. <laughs> He's like, I like yeah. that. I like that. No, I, I haven't watched anime. <laughs> <laughs> like, at all. Just like Jerry. Yeah. yeah. Just like all. Just like you. I watch a little bit. You're getting back into just it? A little bit. Yeah, but so I, I've, I've seen some Karens on trains, but mm. normally everyone just does their best to ignore it. Yeah. How Literally. long have you guys lived here? Three years. Yeah, kind of three and a half years now. That's it? Coming oh, on four years. That's it? What do you mean, that's it? That's, oh, a, that's a long time. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's, it's crazy because you see people online that are like, dude, I'm just gonna like study for like a two, two, three weeks and I'll be, I'll be comfortable. Mm. And it's yeah. like, man, I was here for eight months until I felt like I could order a coffee without shitting myself. <laughs> yeah. You know, it's, it's, it's super stressful to do any activity yeah. here yeah. Yeah. with yeah. the exception yeah. of drinking alcohol. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is one thing that everyone does here. Uh, yeah. And also you probably realize that it's really fucking hard to stay at like a, a you know, there's this conception that Japan is really easy to stay healthy. It's so fucking hard because mm. everyone drinks. Yep. The food is way more like uh, greasy and uh, calorific than you realize. Mm. You're eating rice all the time. Yeah, rice uh, is a great a, You know, and there's loads of like fried stuff. It, it's a lot. It's And especially with the drinking. The drinking is the hardest. You were saying yeah. you gained weight here. I, yeah, because uh, when we went on tour in America, I'd like lost weight. We all lost weight somehow, mm -hmm. all three of us. Um, and then I was back in Japan and I'd weighed myself like yesterday, um, and I had gained like three kilos after moving back to Japan. So I lost America weight in America. One. America wow. number one. And I number gained one. We're weight. back. Let's go. We're back, baby. Let's because like also in America, almost everything has like calories on it. Like yeah. the calorie, it tells Legally, you. Legally, yeah, they have and to. That, that's so helpful in Japan. It's like, dude, just on, uh, do you know what's, figure it out. Do you know what's like OP? It's not just the calorie thing, white claw. Like you, you can't get white claw here in Japan, honestly. Because if you if I could get drunk on white claw here, that just mm. removes half the calorie intake that I could like possibly get. Yeah, yeah. and, and like white claw is just like normalized in America. Yeah, I think I'm gonna come back five pounds heavier because I mm. end every night with at least one drink in Golden Guy. I <laughs> love that place. Every wait, night. Wait, 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 how many times have you gone to Golden Guy? What's up? I've only gone twice. Oh, okay, I had an okay. awkward experience the last time I went. 
What did All you right, what was it? it was, so we were at this bar. It was great. Great vibes. Oh, God. Okay. Yeah. yeah. This it was, is crazy. It was great vibes. Uh, I was getting the guy, the barkeep, drinks. He gave us free tequila shots. It was like four of us. All right, all right. Um, and and, and it, was, it was a great night. And at one point, he's like, what do you do? I'm like, ah, YouTuber. And he's like, hmm. And so he's like, what's the channel name? And I'm like, Ludwig. So he looks it up on his phone, and then he pulls up a recent VOD. Oh, and I saw this your story. He happens to have like a TV that's for karaoke that shows what is like on his phone. Right. Uh, and he put on the top VOD, which right now is a mogul mail that I recently uploaded about a bit of an awkward situation. No! <laughs> he just stops playing that. And he just oh, he just God. he just rips it, and we all are immediately like, oh no, oh no. <laughs> but like he in his head is like, this oh, is oh, <laughs> Famous. Yeah, wow. he's like, ah, oh, they're getting, they're, he's getting, getting embarrassed. But I'm like, not for the right. <laughs> <laughs> and, I, and I have to like pivot. I'm trying to figure out how to like contextualize this to this Japanese guy who doesn't know any American YouTube. I'm like, karaoke, and he's like, yeah. So we just pivot to karaoke, sing, stay with me. It's good, right? That's that was good. good. Was yeah. there anyone else in the ball? Or was it just you guys? It was. Uh, it, we had four of us, and then there was like uh, his friend. I feel like a lot of the places in Golden Guy, like maybe a friend will just hang out with the yeah. barkeep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then this Italian Air Force dude who's pretty oh. tight. Cool. Yeah, because like I, I always wonder how a lot of these bars in Golden Guy stay in business, because a lot of bars mm. in Golden Guy is just one single room. And it's fucking tiny. And you know what's most amazing? No matter how tiny the bar is, they will find a way to put a toilet in there somewhere. Yes. Like, you know, you know? Yeah. It's like it's incredible. Cramped, well, I, I know how they say in business, they, they're fucking gouging foreigners. Oh, yeah. That's true. That's I walked true. into a spot and, and we sit down. They're like, cover charge. I'm like, great. And they're like, for each of you. I'm like, dope. It's like a thousand yen. I'm yeah. like, that's yeah, pretty common. Yeah, yeah, it was a lot of money. And then each drink was also a thousand yen. I think we spent fifty dollars in five minutes at that bar. No, it's like <laughs> seven thousand yen or something. Yeah, there, yeah, there yeah, are yeah. some bars that uh, will appeal more to foreigners because they'll have a lot of English stuff, but then they'll also charge more. Right. A lot of the bars that don't have anything will charge less than that. And so a lot of them don't do cover charge. But normally the ones that are trying to get tourists charge a fuck ton because they, they know people are willing to spend. Mm -hmm. yeah. And what mm -hmm. are you going to do when a small Japanese lady hands you like a giant bill? You're like, oh, got to pay it. Yeah, kind of have to. Did you guys move here not knowing a lot of Japanese or did you study like before? We, we didn't know any Japanese. Really? Yeah. You just here. ripped it? Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. crazy. Honestly, best way to learn is go to Golden Guy. <laughs> get, get, get pissed drunk. That's my and school, then, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, genuinely. Like, that's how I learned most of my speaking. Which mango, mango. There, getting drunk. Yeah. I pretty taught like a toddler. Uh, which I do, um, but you know, I get the job done. You you speak pretty well, at least I think. Oh well, the thing. Is. <laughs> well, it, yeah, it helps, like you can it tell. Helps, yeah. it helps well, you don't know anything. Yeah. <laughs> when I travel with him, he he's like he never chokes a situation. It's not they never say something. He's like. <laughs> like you seem to be able to navigate pretty much every like <laughs> Yeah, I mean a lot of the time some if they if they say something I don't I don't know, and then if cause someone will be like, Do you understand that? I'll be like <laughs> <laughs> but but you you just ride it out because a lot of the times in Japan they just talk a lot and the main point is like one percent of what they said. But they there's like so word problems in grade school. Yeah, and and so a lot of the times you just listen out for like keywords or you can kind of if you don't get it you just ask a question that kind of maybe gives you an answer to more to what they're trying to say. Mm. Obviously, you could just also just learn more Japanese. Um, yeah, that's that's the uh, that's the right thing to do, but yeah. we we don't do that. We just go by like the dialogue tree option, mm. whereas you listen for certain it. words and via the context, you kind of like open up your dialogue tree yeah. Of, yeah. of like common Japanese phrases. Cause like a lot of Japanese conversations, especially if you're in the service industry, they all say the same shit, just using different words, right? Yeah. I mean, um, you know, if you just chill out, you can probably figure out what they're trying to ask you. Um, and so, you, you know, you just work through it. It's pretty chill. I, I, I don't, you know, the only things I don't really do in Japan is like taxes and go into the government hall, but I don't do that. I don't do that in English. I don't do I that in so America. I do my, right? I do Come on. I don't do hey, it me and you <laughs> both, brother. God damn. That's a real patriot. Well, if you're watching this, we are in Nippon and our plan to have blunderbusses has not worked out. <laughs> You always freak out when I say blunderbuss, and you shouldn't, because it can mean anything. Maybe it's my gamer tag. But that's not to say we have to pay the bills while we're in Japan taking it all back. Brilliant.org has thousands of lessons, Aiden. I need you to be present for this, okay? I, you keep freaking out we're all the gonna, time. We're not going to take it's it. It's the best way to learn math, science, computer science interactively. Learning a little bit every day can have a huge impact. Haven't you learned? 
and geopolitics <laughs> and geopolitics that and you sovereign can, nations brilliant.org will tell you you can't take your liberty with you on the plane <laughs> you but you you can't learn a go, little every day go to brilliant.org slash the yard the first 200 people who sign up get 20 percent off brilliant's annual premium subscription all right and we're nobody's gonna do a taking puzzle. anything back we're gonna do an exercise where we'll show you exactly what we mean this is knowledge and uncertainty because it's not certain and I'm aiden that we're gonna end up back home i'm certain i'm certain that we will arrive and leave with no Nothing out of the ordinary. Well, let's see then. How about we do logic? Yeah. Because it's very logical, Aiden, to assume that we will not make it back home. We... <laughs> On certain lines, there are two types of islanders. Knights who always tell the truth and knaves who always lie. That's like you. You meet two <laughs> islanders named Aditya and Bowie. You've been stealing my mail. Aditya says Bowie is a knight and I am a knight. And Bowie says Aditya is a knave or I am a knave. I think it's number... Bowie is a knight. Yeah, Bowie's Bowie's a knight. A, Aditya is the knave, and a bow and Bowie is the knight. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, that's the kind that happens when you use Brilliant.org. On the same island, you find three friends named Channing, Daja, and Ira. Irish. Uh, She's Irish. <laughs> Channing says exactly two of us are knights. She's a Gaelic Daja, broad. Ira, Ira, and myself are knights. Uh, Ira says Channing or Daja. Is a knave. Uh, Channing's type is unknown is without Channing further information. Is that's such a, a mix up. That, knave? I don't think that's. Is that the answer? That's such a mix up that I, it's got to be it. Because that's like, yeah, let's go. Nice, nice. Don't you get it? I look. I don't feel like you're talking about the puzzles when you say that. No, you understand. Let's, can we go to the next question? Our lives are going to be different. Now, can you came across two out. more friends named Fiad and Greg, but only Fiad says anything. Fiad says. If I'm a knight, Greg is a knave. Uh, there isn't enough information to be... Certain. No, 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 oh, you're stupid. Uh, Greg is a knave. Because you is, know what? Because I believe there people. There isn't enough Be information. Believe, believe there women. There isn't enough believe information. Women. Is Zipper correct? Let's go! All right, guys. That's the, that's the kind of hot, oh, hot brain dude, action that you I get. Why am I wrong? Now I want to keep playing. Anyway, thanks so much. Uh, we're going to get back to the episode. And we're going to get back to the episode and back home. Not certain. And back, that is certain. There's no, there will be more episodes there's because we no will make indication them that we when will we get it home. back home. I don't... <laughs> you're so insistent. You will... S Who knows? How, who's to say? I say... Hey, what's up, y'all? Nick, Hello. how you doing? Hey. You guys, so I see, I notice you don't have the heater on your bidet on. Is that like a funny prank you're doing on me? Or? Wait, what? It's like the, the what? seat's not warm. It's like a cold. Which one? Right. Upstairs or downstairs? Upstairs. Wait, what? It's it like should a, be. It's like a sexual thing uh, you're doing, or what is it? Who turned it off? Who turned <laughs> it off? <laughs> it must be on. It's kind of, kind of a... <laughs> A bit of an energy saver yeah, situation. Swipe deluxe it doesn't work. Okay, <laughs> what, what, we're slandering? <laughs> <laughs> Has Ludwig turned you on bidets even before coming to oh Japan? Oh my god, then? it's the single, it's the single most useful it's addition so to my life that he has provided. It's probably the only value to my life he has provided. Dude, I've given life. you like so many amazing gifts, it's and like you still talk about the bidet gift. Thing that like he has provided. It's good. Yeah. When you when you, when you adopt it, it changes yeah. your life. Change I'm your life. trying to switch America, but man, are they real prude about their buttholes? I think it's also just a pain in the ass to install a bidet. Yeah. It's fucking annoying. I have done it worse yeah. more times than I've done it well. If there was a, like an Uber service where you could just pay a dude to turn there, up. There is. Amazon uh, has that. It's literally called prime a order with don't. installation. <laughs> <laughs> it needs to be like a, approachable. Cause no one wants to call a plumber. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, sure, sure, sure. It yeah. also can, this is like for Americans, it converts you to a sitter when you oh. pee. Yeah, I'm a sitter now all the way. Yeah, which I think I spend more time in the bathroom now, which is... I like that. It's great. It's, it's great. good for me. I don't think it's good for, like, my productivity or anything, but I, I like it. Of course, I love it. <laughs> it's fine. I, a bathroom is a sanctuary, man. You should spend more time there. Honestly, oh, I, I would not have a YouTube career if I could not spend time just sitting on the shitter, because that's where most of my ideas come from, actually. I like that uh, here they have the, uh, the distraction button. Oh, oh, yeah, play that I, I wish you would noises. play like like Waka Flocka or something. That'd be tight as fuck. Wait, what does the distraction button do? It, it just goes like, and like no one can hear you shitting. Oh, I see, yeah, I see. Yeah. But yeah. if it just played like trap music, 
just goes, oh. <laughs> it, it, it auto-tunes <laughs> the sounds that you make yeah. when you shit. <laughs> <laughs> reverb, reverb. <laughs> but it's weird because it's like, I feel like if you play it, you're almost drawing more attention to yourself that you're shitting. Yeah, right. that, dude, that's exactly like, what that's, I was thinking. I, yeah. I feel like it's so counterintuitive. I, I, fuck, I put down a high score in the mall we were at and I couldn't believe there was a bidet in there. I was like, oh my God, there's bidets everywhere. It's so fucking tight. So I go, I sit yeah, down yeah. and I'm like, I should use the button, but I'm like, wait, then everyone knows I'm shitting. Yeah, yeah, yeah everyone knows. So I try, I just tried to have this the quietest shit I could. You can't do that. You got big donkers, That's what I'm bro. Saying. <laughs> I was fucking biting my fist. <laughs> 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 what are you biting your fist? What are you? Ah! <laughs> I, I might come. <laughs> I, don't, I don't want to hear the fun. Yeah, 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 they got a button for that. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> have you tried? Have you found one with the? Uh, it's like rare, but some of them have dryers. Oh, well. we have one in our house. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Really fun. Yeah. Although it doesn't really do a good. No, job. It's, no. don't use the dryer it it, takes if you're at home. Minutes and I like to cool. believe the dryer does a good job. I don't like doing dryers with my hands. Why would I use it for my butthole? What does that mean? You don't like the hand dryer as opposed to paper, paper towel. Paper? Yeah, yeah. I think if they had like a Dyson air blade in your, in, in like <laughs> and it's just like ass, it's like just a hole size, like it's a yeah, pin, yeah. like like the bidet, and it'll go back and forth. Yeah. yeah. Did you know that I, it'll go back? Oh, and forth. oscillating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Press it twice. Yeah, 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 yeah. We have the good the Toto one. Yeah. Bro, we they should put like a, like a jet engine in there. So like when you yeah. shit, it just disintegrates it, but then you can reverse the engine and it'll blow. Like a garbage disposal. Yeah, shit. it'll like dry you after. So it does both. Okay, but. I thought you were gonna say send the shit up. It'll, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. it'll, it'll only send you back the nutrients you need. Yeah, <laughs> no drop wasted. Uh, I got heavily, heavily addicted to an arcade game last night. Oh, you wrong. did, you did. <laughs> It was, I, uh, it was the worst arcade uh, game you could have possibly chosen. Was, dude, well. I, he was in the coin dude. So it was awesome. <laughs> I'm, I'm a vibes guy, but I kill the vibes. Yeah, Garn, I'll let you tell the story. I was yeah. So we went into the arcade machine, and normally when you go into a Japanese arcade, people, you know, they play like the rhythm games or one of like the cool kind of like battle royales. Uh, first thing Ludwig does is just go straight to the horse betting machine. Like oh that, God, that's the so first you, thing he does. You so, didn't you do a video being like, I am a gambling addict. I'm trying to better. And then you go straight for the gambling machine. <laughs> and the <laughs> worst kind of gambling, virtual horses. Yeah. Yeah, I wish they were real. Yeah, so yeah. <laughs> so, so. What is the, why the fuck would you want them to be virtual? I don't understand. He's, he's LARPing being a real dad. He's yeah. just practicing. So to preface, gambling is illegal in Japan. <laughs> so you it's can't. Like, it's like the biggest asterisk ever. Yeah. yeah. Gambling is illegal, but. Yeah, in same with child case, porn. Yeah. <laughs> 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 both illegal here. Yeah, both both <laughs> illegal. Uh, but in this one place we went to, you could not win anything. You could, the only thing you could possibly win is more tokens, mm-hmm. uh, which Ludwig, so Ludwig uh, exchanged <laughs> like 30 bucks worth of tokens, which I think is more than anyone's ever exchanged in this one. I accidentally went to a machine that was like mass transfer. Like there's normal machines. It's like, oh, uh, yeah, put in a hundred yeah. bucks. And then there's one that's like, ah, oh, it's minimum 30 bucks. And I went to that one because I didn't know the difference. And so I had to, like, just like a shit ton. I had tokens for like a <laughs> group of school yeah, children. trying to explain to me, he's like, no, 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 you can like exchange the coins. And I'm like, well, what do you, can you what can you exchange them for? He's like, well, more, more coins. More coins. Yeah. You can, the coins allow you to keep playing. Yeah. I'm like playing the game that like, gives you are coins. These, are these money coins? Or no, like no, no, their no. Own these, these, these no. are, th- so, so he got like, he got like big tokens, which you right. could explain, uh, which you could exchange for even like smaller coins, which you can use for the machines. It's a so, really um, fun game. So yeah. <laughs> transferred your money, which works universally anywhere. Uh-huh. For yeah. A piece of plastic that yeah. only works in this one thing. Machine, yeah. yeah. They said crypto was crazy. <laughs> And it, and it it turned to be shit. Yeah. Well, this one might not be. <laughs> so he fa- so after the horse bet, um horse racing uh, machine, he found this new machine, oh which uh, the gameplay of this machine was how fast can you put the coins into this machine? Yeah, and see and, how fast they come out yeah. sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> and, and depending on how fast you put coins into machine this machine, it shits out more coins. <laughs> so you can just gambling. <laughs> yeah. It's not even gambling because it it's, was like a laundromat simulator. Like, yeah. Like he was just practicing putting coins in something. And it's, and it's like there is a mechanical level of skill you need to quickly get the coins into a group and then th- put them in the machine because it has like a slot. And at the start, I was kind of bad, so I hired the help of Gart and Aaron. And I was like, you guys get this side. I'll get this yeah, side. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and Aaron at one point, and I'm like, so how you doing? He's like, I have a follower. And he has like a little monster following him in the game. And I'm like, what's that mean? And he's like, well, I, it gives me the monster, and now he follows me, and I'll just he'll always follow me. And I'm like, can yeah. you take it with you after? He's like, no. She's gonna follow me for now. And I yeah. go over to Ludwig, I'm like, how are you doing? He's like, I have a follower. And they are not communicating, but they both like individually came to the conclusion that this is valuable. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, so somehow like there was like an RNG mechanic where sometimes you can summon an 
in game. Like there was a screen <laughs> where I don't. It sounds like shit. It, it is. Yeah. It it's is the, so it's like, shit. Um, the girl bars where you can like pay for people to hang out with you. It's like the follower kind of keeps right. you on the machine. Right. Like, at least it feels you like get, you're on a journey. At right, least right, you right. get companionship out of that. <laughs> what do you get out of this? Is more coins. More coins. More coins. <laughs> yeah. I, I, think, yes, I think it was like about half yeah. an hour into this where we kind of just <laughs> sat there. Like we had this realization of like, why are we playing this? And you were just like, no, 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 dude. You don't understand. Get more coins. Then and I'm and and I think Nick. Asked, so what do you do with the coins? Well, you get to play more. Uh -huh. uh, and then uh, after you play more, you get more coins. And sometimes you get like a jackpot where this you get like- awful. It, yeah. it, was, it was like Parasite and he's in the basement <laughs> and then the camera like goes up through the levels and we're like sophisticated playing the claw machines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we, we cannot- we're Sophisticated. We cannot stop winning. We're, we're on the all claw right, section. Right, nice. and, and what I mean by cannot stop winning is uh, Sydney had, had spoke, who speaks Japanese, told the people at Taito to put the toys closer to the edge so yeah, that yeah. we could win more. Yeah. yeah. Which they did for us. Yeah. So uh, we won a bunch. Yeah, well, they, they don't really have the concept of but people might, like, just not play it and ask them to move it. So yeah. it's kind of a trust thing. Right. Yeah. And you can just abuse that. For yeah. sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I realized yeah. it was bad because I, I think I sat there for an hour and a half, and they talked about karaoke and, and going to that 30 minutes in, mm -hmm. and then they kept bringing it up, and I was so sucked into the machine. And in my <laughs> mind, I'm like, I was like, Mom, I can't pause the game. But the game never ends. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And we, we, we keep putting more money. They, yeah. they all walked out, and I'm still playing. And I'm and it's like, at this point, it's a cutscene because it's just making me money because I've put so many coins in at this point. So I'm just watching the coins fall, and I'm just smiling. And then Gart like pokes his head down. And he's like, dude. And I was like, yeah, no, my bad, my bad. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I saw Garnt looked like genuinely concerned. We're all waiting outside. Yeah. And he kind of like for a moment's like, I'm going to go check on him. <laughs> and he goes back in and you come out and you're just, you're still talking about the coins. You're, yeah. you're like, I left about. You're like, oh, dude, I left like 1,500 coins. I left about 2,000 coins. Somebody came up so big. <laughs> the number go, the number keeps going up, by the way. Oh, yeah. okay. It's so yeah. many coins. Can, can um, you do something with these coins? No. You, you could smelt the metal <laughs> and make a sword. <laughs> <laughs> Have you thought about the sword metal? Yeah. No, yeah. I, I think we had just like made a perpetual motion machine. Yeah. Like yeah they yeah. said it's not possible. Just put Ludwig in front of one of those yes, machines. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It'll just go on until the end of the universe. <laughs> I am the perpetual motion. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> there's, um, there's a really cool thing that I've always wanted to play. There's, um, there's like a six party, uh, six player Mario Party gambling machine. Um, and I've, there's only like, there's not many of them left because it's pretty old. Uh, but I just find it really weird that Nintendo <laughs> would allow that. Mm. Uh, but yeah, it's just like Mario Party. They used to be nuts. Yeah, I don't yeah. think Nintendo has a lot of dominance on what they allow here. I was like walking down the street, no, and no, I saw no. Mario, and it was like come into our bank, and it was like a voice bubble. I don't think they signed off on Mario. No, they did. They for sure. Yeah, yeah for what? sure. What? They're sure. way more yeah. lax here. I yeah, think it's super. That's way, it's, they, they're so much more trusting here of like Japanese brands. <laughs> yeah, it's like, like Mario. And he's like read Hello Baby Chapter yeah, Three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> It's, it's, it is odd how like Nintendo is like a, you know, they're like anything Japan related promotion. Like, yeah, fuck it, use Mario, dude, fuck it. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. yeah the like, Pikachu any, Tango anything, was weird. The Pikachu anything. Tango was a bit yeah. weird. It's like, the, it's like the default missing texture when you don't know, yeah. you don't have a graphic for that. Thing. Yeah, yeah, but it's, it's kind of it's kind of strange how they're like really like strict about it abroad and they, they don't give it to companies a lot. Yeah, that's that's true with a lot of Japanese companies. Mm. I think they're just afraid. Ava, Ava as well. Ava, yeah. There's like as, everything Ava. As mm. soon as, as soon as you talk about them using the IP in somewhere abroad, they're like, no, we do not do that. Yeah. Uh, but here, here in Japan, you can get fucking anime Everything. butt plugs. You can live off Ava, literally. There's yeah. Ava food. There's Ava every anything of any you would want, like a gambling machine. It's a video, which you would and need. I can get these uh, anywhere. Someone's You're done saying that. these are really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Done a video. Yeah, yeah. Any, anything Ava you can get. Think about it. There's an Ava version of it. Yeah. But like at the like for the joke like for the butt plug thing it's like a real thing. It's like no, no, you could definitely get an Ava butt plug. That there is definitely an Ava butt plug. Or and it's an, but it's it's like that's like licensed a, IP. Yeah, probably. <laughs> That's Boy, tight. <laughs> okay, I have a question. I have a question on, okay. um, not to bring it back. We can just glaze over this question real quick. All right. Dojinchis. Uh, the question is, are, are those licensed? No. No. But why are they allowed uh, to be sold at a store? Uh, okay. So <laughs> there is, uh, oh. there's there's an un, uh, unspoken trust system. <laughs> Wait, it's, what it's, parties? It's because, it's because if you were working at like, uh, like for Ava, you'd have to say you went into that section. Uh -huh. So you yeah. can't, you, can, you can't admit it. <laughs> okay. okay. So I just like happened to be there and like, it was like, dude, I actually thought it was like the learning section. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> yeah. So there are certain like kind of like IPs that, you will notice get a lot of doujinshis. Yes. And there's a reason for that because there are some IPs that let's say are more family friendly and their companies are much more strict with what uh, they allow as like fan products. Mm. But with some doujinshis, uh, some companies know that fan products help push the sales 
of that certain IP, mostly because their fans are probably horny as fuck. So oh. they know by letting the doujinshi uh, industry exist for their certain IPs that it's gonna like subconsciously push sales. Now, if only they could uh, take this mentality to other aspects yeah. of uh, the it's entertainment odd. industry. Dude, if that they let porn be the <laughs> yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. Right? it's like the Hassan <laughs> Industrial Clip com yeah. uh, Complex. <laughs> it's, it's just like, let's plays? No, no, but porn? Yeah, yeah. we're gonna allow that. There's so many IPs that are, in, like, if there, there was like a big, pedophile meetup, they'd have so much to talk about. They would have like, there's so many IPs that they could talk about that they all like. Yeah, no, it's, it's in Fukuoka. <laughs> it's in Fukuoka. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, fuck all this kid stuff. You guys wanna go get a drink? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get canceled. <laughs> Do people get Welcome upset at you? Trash podcast, uh, everybody. Yeah, it's it's a very like weird topic uh, on, on like, and it's a very heated thing because there's there's like you know online there are a bunch of people who are obviously very staunchly against it. Yeah, but there are in the anime fandom there are also a lot of people who are you know they just believe that uh, that drawings shouldn't be considered in the same thing and mm. it's different culture. Yada yada yada. Same kind of thing. Yeah, I also feel like there's a weird reverence for Japan oh, for, for people sure. who have not yeah. even been to Japan. Oh, sure. for sure. Like nobody's like, dude, I hope you don't break the rules in Thailand. Like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. no, nobody has these like these these concerns or like, dude, you can't go to Indonesia and not speak the language. What the fuck's wrong with you? But yeah, it's Japan's like, you better you better fucking learn some manners, right? Yeah. Respect the culture. Yeah, we were it's so it's dude, so bizarre. We did the McDonald's stream and we were eating a a mega McMuffin. And we didn't finish it, and they were like, "You can't waste food in Japan." I was like, "What? Dude, what do you think that's ex <laughs> <laughs> it's exclusive to Japan?" <laughs> no, that's like a world thing. Yeah. 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 It's like, it's, first of all, anywhere you shouldn't waste food. Second of all, it's a mega McMuffin. All right, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> cut me a break. <laughs> that's so funny. Did someone say that in chat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like it's like <laughs> they spell waste like your waste as well, which oh, I thought okay. was funny. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Uh, but I, I always think when you're in Japan, it's something about like the Japanese culture where everyone's just like. Like so kind of like in their own world that you just don't want to break kind of the yeah. system that they have here, mm. right? It's <laughs> so funny. Like I would be against this shit, but it's so popular. I, just, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to fit in at school, so. <laughs> Everyone wants to fit in, yeah. 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 What's, what's, what's the one thing you've been afraid of that you've like really like afraid of like offending Japanese people or afraid of like not respecting their culture? Um, I get nervous when I'm on a train when I want to sit down and there's like one seat and it's smushed between like three people and my my child birthing hips are trying to squeeze into it. Yeah. So sometimes I'm like, I'll just stand. Bro. Or when there's not like an elder in sight, but the priority section is the only one open. Yeah. And it's like, ooh, I want to sit there, but, but like, am I gonna be a dick for sitting there? It's okay to sit there as long as if, yeah. if someone does, yeah, an older does to come along. Just move. Yeah. I'll fuck yeah. with old people, I guess. <laughs> Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. I've been what? really nervous about walking around with a beverage in my hand, even if I'm not mm. drinking. It. Is that fake <laughs> shit? Uh, yeah, that's bullshit. Yeah, that's, that's bullshit. bullshit. I mean, okay. Here's here's one thing I heard because uh, uh, I've I've heard um, that it's rude to eat and walk at the same time, right? Uh, I think that became like a whole thing just because nobody does it. Yeah. So everyone feels like it's a bad thing, but nobody cares. Just, yeah. You can eat and walk. Just don't make a fucking mess. Because like I remember moving to Japan, I remember reading about oh you can't eat and walk at the well, same. time. Well, you're not time. supposed to. No, 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 go ahead and tell them. Go ahead and tell them yeah. what you think. Gentlemen, you're not supposed to. <laughs> no, wait, 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 wait. What do you mean you're not supposed I, to? Like what you're supposed to do is you get it if you're like at a food stall and then yeah, you yeah. eat it right next to the food stall yeah, and then yeah. you put your wrapper in your pocket and then you pi you piece. Are you talking about just in Japan or in America? In Nihonga. No, no, yeah, no. you do that. <laughs> this is, no, this is beautiful. Yeah, what? he's like he's like telling women how tampons work. Right? <laughs> <laughs> they, they're they're not Japanese. <laughs> not either. If, Joe, if, if I called up Joey right now, he'd say the same thing. He would say like just yeah, just I just do it, man. No, I just, that's my job. That's my job. That's my job. <laughs> I I'm fucking did. Was terrible. <laughs> <laughs> was fucking terrible. <laughs> Why do I sound like someone from, from uh, Peaky Blinders when you talk? Because uh, <laughs> yesterday we were in that shop. <laughs> you were doing Connor impressions. We, we what were, the fuck? We were, we were technically. <laughs> Why am I the one in the doji it, section? It was. It was more because oh, I because I told you. We to go. Yeah, we it was. It the... started Connor impression, but then it moved to the main character from the boys. <laughs> yeah. And then we What's kept that? we kept yeah. saying, "Are oh, you think I'm jerking off to this?" <laughs> This is a sting operation. You think I'm a fucking pedophile. <laughs> oh, you f you think I like this? <laughs> Look at my cock right now. He's soft. <laughs> baby's what like what hundred. Is. is that? That's not even. It's the guy from the boys. No, it's what you like sound like. It's That's authentic. Not what this I is sound you. Like. This is you. <laughs> that is not what I sound like. Well, you probably would be saying the opposite, yeah, yeah, but it no, is no, your yeah. accent. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, no, that that would go against that as well. <laughs> um, oh, yeah. yeah, I don't do the I don't do the eating thing because I did get anxious, but. 
Maybe I'll just do it. You should go to Denny's here. I'm going to order a. F- I have, um, I've seen a lot I'm of. I'm going Denny's. to order a large mm. pizza and walk down the street. <laughs> well, okay, 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 okay. Bro, that's a full bro, fucking okay. meal. Like that's a. Uh, uh, that's look how mad I am. Hey, you guys how told you me it's okay. How the fuck did we get from like? Yeah, yeah. I'll just get a whole fucking bowl of pasta. I hate Italian. Yeah, I'm going to have the pasta with a spoon and I'm going to twirl it while I'm walking. And then if anyone says a shit, I'm going to pull up a picture of Connor. I'm going to say. <laughs> <laughs> he told me he's cool. You can do it as long as it's not French food. Oh, bro. That's a slam dunk. Yeah, yeah. Right here. Don't some, hurt me. Some love at least. Do they have good French food here? Like, I thought I feel like golf tap me. They do love French culture here. That's Karen. They love Italian <laughs> food here. There's so many they Italian. They love everything they, European. Yeah, they love here. everything European. They, I saw El Pollo Loco here. Or no, no, sorry. El Torito here. It's like an American Mexican restaurant. No, I, no idea what that is. They have Mr. Donut here. Have you seen that too? Yeah, we went there, right? We went there. We went it's there, yeah. bad. Wait, is it not Japanese? Uh, Mr. Mm. Donut is American. Is it? Yeah, oh, it, so was, it was garbage. It, yeah, it's was fucking bad. terrible. My it's, donut it, was yeah. fire. It's Mr. Donut. And apparently, because I for a video, I, I miss... I, said the wrong thing. I said it was Japanese because I'd never seen it anywhere else. Uh, it's a it's an American chain. And then most of them got turned into Dunkin' Donuts in the US. American runs on it. That's so. yeah. just facts, bro. Yeah. I've, I've, I've noticed like a few, a few American chains that I've never seen in America. Yeah. Uh, but I think it's because they're just like shit. So what they do is they export yeah. it and then they uh, <laughs> fail in America. But because it's like an American chain here yeah. in Asia, um, it just like stays around. Yeah. It's like, oh, that's your American any? chain. Yeah, Shoney's uh, Pizza. They have Shoney's Pizza here. The fuck is You're that? saying that like I should know it. In, in, in Thailand, there's an ice, cream, uh, an ice cream chain called Swensen. That's Are American. We, that's American from San Francisco. Uh, and I checked uh, this up because I was like, there's no way this is American. Nah, We're not falling for that. Yeah. Nah. Swenson these luck, nuts. Yeah, 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 classic, yeah. classic. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Shoney's like an American thing? I've never heard of it. Bro, we got Denny's, we got Taco Bell, can we got McDonald's. Married at Denny's here? <laughs> what? You can Why? do that in America. You can. And a Taco Bell. Yeah. Okay, well, I'll, why would you want get to get married, first of all? Well, yeah. I'm sorry, I have to explain that to you. Why you get, a, get, married you get fucking free chalupas for life. Pancake puppies and married in the same location. You should go to Danny's. Is, is I, I want to see what you guys think of Danny's here. Is it like good? Danny's hair is like very it's different. It's pretty good. It's, it's yeah. extremely different. You know, yeah, it was it's, wa- it's very different. It was a wake up call. Last time I was in Japan, which was like six years ago, I went to Yoshinoya and I've yeah. never been there in America. Oh. So I was like, okay, yeah, it's pretty decent food. I went home and I was like, oh, Yoshinoya. I, sh- I went there in Japan. I should go eat there. That shit was different. It's so it bad. So much it's worse. so bad in America. Yeah. Isn't it? It's like totally different like uh, menu as well, right? It's it's. It's uh, like they use like worse cows. <laughs> <laughs> like they, it just feels like <laughs> USDA prime beef, baby. It's just you know? worse food. It probably is just worse cows. And it's also way more imbalanced. I feel like they just have only rice. Yeah. And they give you like three pieces of beef yeah. with like two <laughs> oh, carrots that are steamed. In, in like Yoshinara, <laughs> Sukiya, um, well, I, I, I got to ask, have you guys had a hamburger yet? <sighs> like a hamburger? This is no, like no, no, a, a hamburger. Are but not right? a hamburger, a hamburger. That's how Ludwig would try to say hamburger. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. In a Japanese Dude, language. and you'd be right, okay? Half right. the time, half the time when I'm trying to speak Japanese to someone because there's so many okay, American okay. stolen right. words. Yeah. I know. I know. I learned this. <laughs> if, if you go to Denny's, you can you can't get a hamburger, but you can get a hamburger, which is kind of like a <laughs> You keep saying it weird. It's shit. It's shit. Is it just oh, is it okay, what, wait, what I saw, maybe I saw this at 7 Eleven. Is it just like ground beef circles? Yeah, it's just like the patty. Yes. Uh, patty with, with like veg on the side. Yeah, with veg and uh fries or potatoes. And it's not flat. It's like usually like they're thick little bulbs. Yeah, they're like boys. really, really thick. They're so very thick. It's almost like a deconstructed burger just without the like the bread. So shit. It's called and open face in America. Yeah. Why? Do That's they like open that? Face burger. That sounds like a slur. I don't know I why. Don't know. Oh, say, say it in front of your friend. <laughs> I, hate uh, it. I hate it so much. That sounds tight. I want to try one. You know what I do want to try? Sydney was telling us about a vor cafe. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, that <laughs> shit sounds... I, I think I found what I really want to do while I'm here. I hear you go down a mouth slide into a stomach pool. Yeah. yeah. Goo. Yeah. Um, so yeah. Then? Sydney got offered to do a video there, and yeah. then she had to sign a waiver that says that if she dies via asphyxiation in any of the rooms, um, they're not like liable. And she was like, I don't feel like doing this anymore. And that stomach go deep. <laughs> uh, okay, well, I'm, I'm like, what the fuck is going I on? I want to know what the, what the goo feel like. <laughs> You ever wonder that? You ever wonder what the goo? You just have like? a vor fetish, and yeah. it's okay yeah. to express <laughs> it. I think, I think but we I'm don't to, have I don't, that. I can't, really, I can't <laughs> confidently say I do yet. You know? you <laughs> I, you're in the right I, country. Maybe, you're in the right country to try out. What, I, I might put curious? my toes in the in the goo sand equivalent, whatever they got in there, and figure out I don't like it. 
Dude, you should have signed a waiver for what happened to you in that uh, Muscle Girl Cafe. Yeah, that was fun. <laughs> oh, I heard you got ran train on with Dude, I got, fists. I got beat up. That's Are you bruised up. at all? No, but my face still hurts. You look kind of fucked up. Yeah, I, we're, that's my I heard, I, I, I heard the entire <laughs> squad showed up. I just like yeah. <laughs> the dude. The dude brought like the entire roster. It was it was insane. It was like you Smash Bros. Everybody was here, man. And they just, they went to town. <laughs> they went to town. They I thought they were going to slap me. It was going to be funny and kind of like, oh, wow. Nice. Yeah. It wasn't. It was like you, you like murdered my son slap. Like it was full on. Surely that's yeah. someone's like dream. For sure. For sure. Yeah. And you pay $30 a slap normally. Um, Wait, person. No, for, for them to slap you. Not for them to slap you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ooh, yeah. How many slaps do you get for 30 bucks? One, I think. I think yeah, it's probably maybe everyone that works there. Do you think it's just one? No, no. It's like, like a wow. bunch of people. And a drink, I think, right? Surely, yeah, a, you, get a drink, surely you, you get a drink with that, right? <laughs> Come on, yeah. After? But yeah, no, they, they they beat the shit out of me. It was kind of insane. Do, yeah, they, do they, they have like a like a job on the side, or are they just really strong for this I job? I think that's I, what they do. Yeah, that's what that's the job. Dude, I didn't have to sign a waiver or anything. Like, I was like... You should have, bro, because that... I, for sure. I you could have come, like, the next day, loopy. You could have been concussed. For sure. Just, like, yeah. it, they just know no one would go to the hospital like, I got slapped by it. Yeah, I mean... I, got, I paid for a girl to slap me and it hurt too bad. The video won't Not. be out when this comes out, but... It won't be? Uh, no, it probably won't be. Oh. But it's fine. We, we can talk about all right, it. All right, all right, all right. I mean, it's, it's so fucking insane. This is coming out in, like, two weeks. Yeah, yeah, yeah it won't be out. Okay, okay, yeah, okay. But, like, yeah, I mean, it was, uh, it was a lot, and... Uh, Definitely don't think I want to get slapped that hard again. They slapped me way harder than we yeah, did. Yeah, there's 18 boxing. slaps in a row. Yeah. 18 slaps in a row. Okay, well, they did not let I, I, thought it was, I thought it was fucked up that he didn't split nine and nine with you, and I want you to know I would have split with you. Well, they first of all, laughing. first of all, think, his I think, video. I think they also <laughs> saw the strength at which they were going, and uh -huh. none of them wanted to participate. Nope. Yeah, yeah. so first the logic was his video, but second of all, I didn't know how hard the slaps were going in. So I didn't know either. We did rock, paper, scissors for who yeah. would get slapped, and he lost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like, it's like. Scissors? Uh, yeah. Was was yeah, it harder than you guys went at your fucking slap? Uh, yeah, boxing? I think so. I think so. Maybe with the exception of like the last slap that I did, but I think yeah. But like, but eighteen of that is fucked yeah. up. And, yeah. And they didn't give me any like, you know how like uh, Charlie be like, yeah, they should have been wearing uh, ear guards and cotton in their mouth like that. We we didn't have any of that. Is that no. a voice critical thing? What yeah. Oh, okay. Because because if you get slapped nice. and you get hit in the ear, you can just push wind into it, and then your eardrum can pop. In dude, really they easily. Dude, they were, <laughs> it makes a nice little whistle. On one the of them side. was wearing a ring. I'm pretty sure. Like, one yeah, of, she turned it inwards. Yeah, one of them fucking <laughs> clapped my neck. One of them, like one of them went for the temple. It yeah, was fucked up. That is I, so I, tight. And then you you have to wonder who's going there and who's uh who's leaving bricked up. Yeah, yeah. I saw Chris leaving it there again last night. <laughs> <laughs> he went for round two. Uh, it's in like a very sketchy area as well. It was in, uh, it's pretty we, popular actually. As well, extremely because uh, we rented the place out for two hours and um. Literally, the moment it opened, um, there was two dudes who just came in. It was so awkward. Yeah. Kyle started talking to them in Japanese and was like, nah, leave. We filmed, you know, we this we got it. And they were like, Korean, <laughs> please. I like how they're <laughs> like literally five minutes before opening, ready, lined yeah, up at the Muscle yeah, Girl right. Bar. Like, all right, come on, baby. The ones that want to get slapped. Yeah, right. right. Like, Yo, I'm in line, baby. And yeah. then the moment we were supposed to end, there was already two people so outside the door ready for so friends to come in. And they live stream the whole thing. So I feel like you, you know, if you if you went there and it's like your king, you're getting live streamed, getting like beat up. Yeah. Is there more <laughs> tourists or hundred percent tourists? Basically. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I, I think that that's their like target market now. Mm -hmm. Um, I think they heavily leaned into. I don't know how many Japanese people like to get slapped. I think actually quite a, a lot, lot because a, a lot. lot of girls bars have this kind of option to get kind of like beat up for some reason. Because yeah. it like, kind of makes sense in a muscle go bar. This one time I went to like a uh, steampunk. Uh, that sounds wife. tight. Yeah. Yeah. I, I thought. I, I thought. You know, this steampunk. What's the worst thing that can happen? Can't in go steam? wrong. Need some gears. Yeah. You just like you see some gears, see some cool. Couple settings. gizmos. Yeah. Whatever. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. So there was an option there uh, to get fucking uh, whipped at full strength with like a like an actual whip. Like an actual whip. Dude, that would hurt so. That would bad. make you bleed. Yeah. It, it's uh, blood. It, it fucking hurt. You did it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we <went. laughs> he's like, he's like, and, and, and I wanted to make sure nothing crazy was there, yeah, yeah, yeah. but I had to do it. <laughs> okay, it, it, clothes, it was, right? it was, it was for a video. I will. Oh, say. okay. Was, what for, did you bleed? Blood? I didn't. I didn't. I was. I was wearing yeah, clothes he's, at he's the not, time. He's not like fucking Jesus on the cross. He's yeah. not like go full and slap me. <laughs> oh, the, cru the crucifixion yeah. cafe. Yeah. 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 Well, they, they, I probably have something like that. <laughs> That's probably something. There's probably something like that. Get crucified for thirty dollars. Think about anything. They probably have it. Yeah. Any theme. They have it. That's rule 35. 
It's after. <laughs> <laughs> what are the first 34? Three, <laughs> three. Any, like, there's like a bazillion bunny girl cafe, uh, mm, uh, yeah. girls bars, they're like everywhere. Yeah, there's, 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 there's like a bar where uh, girls will treat you like a baby and like they'll like, I, I, I think that's a that's that, that's actually a name for that fetish. But they'll literally treat you like a baby and like, like they'll you give you a bottle. And like and let them give you a bottle. They change you. I don't know. Maybe. Probably. That's if like I, this. I, okay, hold on. So I'm wearing an all white painter's outfit. Oh my god. And, <laughs> shit yourself, and I shit myself okay. in the baby bar. Are they? What are that's they, probably what are the only place where they'll be like. Are we? Are we talking wet wipe? Are we talking? <laughs> we're talking ten thousand yen up front, yeah. and then ten thousand yen when they're done. Yo, you better be buying like thirty drinks by the end of this to tip them, man. Japan, I'll buy whatever. It's normally a price. Yeah. People will normally do something fucking weird for a price. Yeah. It's kind of. It's kind of gross. Or. Er, 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 like, have you noticed Japanese people be embarrassed about the fetishes that they have? Like, if mm. someone's caught at a maid cafe, is that embarrassing? Uh, or like, no, not really. I, I, I wouldn't say so. The people who no. go to those cafes are normally not shy about it. Right. Um, yeah. One thing that I've always been shocked by is how open people are about uh, them if they like uh, buy prostitutes or hire prostitutes. Mm. It's weirdly some Japanese people are really open about it, and I always thought like if people did that, they would just be. It really embarrassed. You wouldn't tell people, but if you just go to some bars, you're like, "Hey, you know, what do you like to do?" Be like, "Huh, Soapland." Yeah. Oh, that's what the prostitute place is. Uh, yeah, it's yeah. called Soapland. You'll, you'll notice it if you start looking out. There's they're everywhere. Yeah. Like, like S O A P Land. Yeah. Soap yeah. Land. It, you write it down. <laughs> no, I, I want to know what to avoid. <laughs> yeah. 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 They, they wash you. They, they do wash you. They do wash you. <laughs> Why do you keep saying it like and that? The, like, loop, the loophole is because prostitution is illegal in Japan, yeah. even though it's widely uh, readily available. Yeah. Uh -huh. Wait, uh, but it, isn't it legal if it's your butt and also your also mouth in your butt? <laughs> uh, well, isn't that I, how that I, works? I, I think so, but in Japan, right? I thought it was only vaginal penetration. I thought that was the thing. It might be. How'd you know this? Yeah. He's, I, he's... I watch a lot of Naruto. <laughs> but, but, the, the, <laughs> <laughs> but the thing is, is that uh, I, I guess that the, the loophole around it is that they claim is that like, uh, well, you know, you pay for the service of being washed. And if something of passion happens, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. I, this is genuinely, bro. This is genuinely it was a yeah. shower. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is like some kind of like weird justification. They had really good yeah. soaps there. That is yeah, so that's that's why. Fucking funny. Wait, that's why they call soap land. Yes. Wait, you just got that. <laughs> You'll see it. You'll see it every now Shinjuku, that we've mentioned it. Now that we've mentioned it, definitely in your area, there's a lot. Because oh, so it's gonna like it's gonna be like one of those. I don't know what they call that phenomenon, but it's like you see, like you hear about it, and then you mm -hmm. see. Yeah, yeah. Okay, you will okay. see a lot yeah. of them. I have great news. What's that? What is it? They changed the URL for Factor. <gasps> no yeah. way. They actually changed it. It went from go.factor.75.com yeah. slash the yard 43. Yeah. Uh, to now factormeals.com forward slash the yard 50. Why? Which is way is better. So it better. used to be a Bitcoin address. New year, new goals, new fucking URL. <laughs> Factors ready to eat meals straight to your <laughs> fucking mouth. You know what? I actually don't like when you read that. Why? I don't straight. think you do it well. You don't think I'm yeah. like, I prefer you just sing the ridiculous Skip the grocery stuff. store, the chopping, the prepping. What are you saying? Why are you saying like, so I'm like fucking you, reading my ads like, like you don't mean it. I'm a podcaster. You don't mean it. You're saying I'm a professional. It. I literally am a professional. Did right, you know that? Finish it up. Finish it up. Fucking no. <laughs> oh, professional. Well, you factor. Job. What do you fucking like about it, huh? Uh, what I like about factor, the fact that I know I can count my calories. That's it. It's actually like convenient wise, counting calories is like probably the most valuable thing you can do to lose weight or gain weight or just have like a good macro Which balance. Which you've only done one of. And so, you know, what my favorite thing to do with factor is I, I like to heat them up to their to their where they're really, really hot, way more than you're supposed to. And yeah. then I like to throw them at Ludwig's face like a pie. Dude, this is such a bad thing to no, say. No, but you need to buy them the to do that. Oh, you gotta buy them. You can, and you, you and still you can buy still them, eat it off of his face. You like know what dog. I like to do with factor? I like to, I like to taste that heat again. it up real hot and throw it at kids in the neighborhood. I know, I'm not doing it at kids. I know, but like, 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 like from that logic, would you then defend it and say, will you sell to buy it? Or maybe it? you just want to eat them. You can and still eat that's it what off I was of like a dog. So you have 34 meal choices per week. Yes, you guys don't eat this. You guys are faking the funk. I eat I this. I ate these all the time yeah, dude, when we, we lived together. What are you and, talking and, about? They're and, so and good. How, you're like, hey, you want a factor? And I'm like, how yes. How long ago? Every single time Forever that ago. you asked me to eat a factor meal, I would be like, yes, Ludwig, I would like a factor meal. The last Name one time I said no. Name one time. He actually you, said you, them all the time. You, you eat factor as frequently as you frag out in a show match against Tarek.
outdated, but Ooh, okay. anyway, Factor is good because you can track and it also tastes good and it's also they really keto. easy to do. It's calorie you smart. If you're a meal choices keto user, per week. you can use it. I think you can also switch it up a lot. It's 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 insanely convenient. It's actually really good. We actually eat it with our real human mouths. Look, it's I'm not a, a joke. I'm gonna, I eat it. I'm gonna keep it a bean with you, boys and girls. Bean. Where can we go to get this? Uh, factormeal.com. Factormeals.com slash the yard fifty for fifty percent off. It's kind of simple. It's so easy. Your first box. Finally. That's not bad. That's That's not first bad. Box. And they have to use the code the yard fifty. Yeah, fifty percent off for America's so use it. number one ready to eat meal kit. Ba na 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 yeah 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 Welcome, oh, man. Welcome, welcome. welcome. Uh, can, can we get another glass of water, please, yeah. by the way? Oh, I would love one. Yeah. I didn't know I could ask for that. Yeah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Thank you. Actually, none for Nick. He's not allowed. Uh, <laughs> only, only like trash taste hosts are allowed, actually. Hey, hold on, wait for this. <laughs> that's fine, that's fine. So, it's got water so what now? Nice table. No, that's like, a, that's actually the shape yeah, of Japan. Cup. It's not mine. It's a gecko. Oh. Well, I guess it's not. It was the Anthony's. It's a gecko. Oh, fuck. I'll clean this later. All right. All right, <laughs> soap <laughs> All right, so soap plans. Yeah. yeah. Did you know about Wait, this? Is that why Sonic wears soap shoes? No, no, no. That's is that where that comes from? I, it could be. Oh <laughs> shit! He's like, he's just trying to get there as fast as he can. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he's got coins. He's like Ludwig. <laughs> oh my Holy God. shit! Sonic is a metaphor. Lud Ludwig is pretty much like Sonic, I'd say. Yeah, yeah. they're the same. Yeah, yeah. I think that, he's like the Sonic the Hedgehog of busting nuts. <laughs> 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 That's a good yeah. people, people watch this show, right? Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, oh, the yard? They make it this far, right? <laughs> <laughs> you guys put, yeah. you put your logo up, so <laughs> I figure <laughs> out. Yeah. I figure out to your shtick. I get you know? it. We can put this one on your guys' channel <laughs> if you guys want it. It's <laughs> fine. You put it on your channel. We keep the Patreon episode. You guys do. You're yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's, 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 it's all good. So it's all good. Uh, I was at this place, uh, Shosen Book Tower, earlier yeah. that day. Oh, okay. okay, you've been there. And uh, at the, uh, I'd been there once before, so I knew like the layout of the store and kind of the manga and gaming stuff is like towards the top, right? I'm yeah. trying to find, I'm trying to find a Super Mario art book. No, you're not. I, yes. I was. Yes. I actually am. This place, <laughs> this place behind the veil, all Mario. <laughs> Uh, uh, but on the top floor, on the top floor, it's just it's just regular porn, you know, just just oh, normal, just, just, regular just normal porn. people. Yeah, just your run yeah. of the mill and, shit. Uh, when I get to that floor, I realize that there's like a queue to take to take photos with these people, and there's some sort of like porn fan meetup on the top floor oh. that I. I, because of the escalator I've chosen to go up, have no choice but to go through the fan meetup line to get to the <laughs> other escalator to go down. Oh, so I'm just like the only foreigner on the top floor in, in this, like, it in just a sea of pornography and people taking photos. And I'm just like quietly, it's like, I have to get out of here. I'm not. It's a very convenient story to uh, <laughs> explain why you lined up. There was no are. veil. Yeah. There was no veil to go through. Well, the veil is the floor, yeah. right? You gotta go up the escalator, I guess. But the the floor downstairs, uh, there there's no, there was no veil. There was no thing that you know. It's it's like gaming books, uh, you know, some some manga that I didn't recognize, and then right next to it is like it, is these kids, and I'm like, oh, that's crazy. I don't even, I, mean, I don't he, even get the courtesy of the veil. He's gonna fly home and do, go through clear, and they're gonna scan his eyeball, and they're gonna be arre they're arrest you. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's like they uh, know what you've seen. In the Seven Eleven, they sell pork mags, right? Yeah, yeah. So it's yeah. like it's like those are just you can see it. That's just kind of out there. See yeah, what it is like you, yeah. you know. Uh, they are shields, shields, though. They are some onigiri and that? some. That's uh, one of my. Porn. That's one of my Japan. Yeah, Japan nitpicks <laughs> is a. Uh, uh, yeah, I saw some of your Japan nitpicks on Twitter actually. Yeah, yeah, that was yeah. that was go, go transportation on. nitpicks. You know, just just small stuff. This was a. Uh, I I just don't like that when I'm like browsing for books that they're packaged. I can't look at what's inside before I buy. Yeah, well, it's it. yeah. a lot of people just read it all. Yeah, uh, <laughs> especially like yeah. Monk, they they manga. manga. They all read it all. That is yeah. a fucking stupid take that he just said. Yeah, I, yeah. I, can't, I don't like that. I can't use the product in the store to its full degree <laughs> yeah. without buying it for free. No, I mean, this is word for word, I, I, yeah. bar, bar for yeah. bar. <laughs> just, there's this weird like monkey part of your brain that's like, I just want to flick through it. I don't know why. I, I it doesn't help me. I just want to make sure it's still there. I just want to make sure yeah. it's a book. Right, I think like, it's, it's not, probably like, from it could be a fake. <laughs> from Officer, I was checking to make sure yeah. it really was a book. <laughs> I, I, I look, what's inside is not my problem. I'm just you're just trying to run out and just like <laughs> knock everything <laughs> over with your dick. <laughs> 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 Because the thing is, with the doujinshis, you can flick through that in like fucking oh, yeah. five minutes, man. Oh, you, you can like, 
It's it's like it's like, hit, it's like a hit and run. To be right? clear, not the books I was trying to go through. Uh, not the okay. Tra- okay. I just want to uh-huh. look at I just want to look at well, Link. Yeah, this Link is, this what, what, what this is a stick. floor building, and yeah. I've heard nothing of the other floors that were yeah. fascinating. There's other yeah. floors. Yeah. yeah, there were other Holy floors. Shit. Well, there was a, there was one floor that's just entirely trains, so that was like a cool floor. The reason I like that. Where do you think they get rid of all? That building has to go somewhere. We got We got a porn actress. Very. Did you go to the floor with the where they have like all the figures in the boxes? Like the the cases. Uh, cool. I don't think there was in that store. Oh, okay. It's all all books, uh, all books. Yeah, just all porn. Okay. Yeah. I, went, I, yeah. I liked seeing the demographics of people okay. in that store on the different floors <laughs> because yeah. uh, on the porn floor, it's like a lot of. Uh, t- it's a lot of guys who like, you know, kind of look like they're there for porn. And then the yeah, guys- I saw like, a guy with only a ponytail, but no other hair. <laughs> <laughs> it was crazy. <laughs> he looked like a Tony Hawk build a character. Well, like the, the like, comic book guy in Simpsons. Like, 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 like no hair and then a ponytail. Oh. But the ponytail was lush. Like like that's the only healthy hair he has. And then he put his, put a little ribbon yeah. on it. Yeah, and, and like that, I'm like, <laughs> that kind of checks out. I, I, but then you go to the, and then I went to like the floor that was like, it was like mostly architecture and trains. And it's like, there's a lot of put together guys on that floor. It's like, they're only Hard there, salary, they're man. only there for some like Frank Lloyd Wright Dude. readings it's in like Japanese. Weird, it's like the weirdest Disneyland you've ever seen where yeah. every room is just differently themed. <laughs> yeah. Tra- <laughs> train attack is a fucking wild here. They are intense. Yeah. Really? Yeah. yeah they, they will like. I, I, I actually like, I think they're more scary than the porn otakus. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, poor like. Wait. Porn otakus, I kind of get them. They just want to jack off. I get it. Train yeah. otakus, they are in so deep. Because most of them aren't beating off to the trains. No. Well, so well, there's, well, so well, where- well, Hold on, well, well, hold up, up. Get... hold up. Yeah, okay, yeah. Uh, they, yeah. They, yeah, they've like, they'll destroy property and stuff and cut down trees to get like a shot of the train, like the way they want. What? There was a clip. Wait, recently. wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Destroy properties. Yeah, yeah. They'll, they'll like go on. For, yeah, they'll- How like, do you destroy a property? To take well, hot like, train as a, as a citizen. Well, let's say like, uh, I don't know, man. Uh, like, let's say that someone's fence is in the way of like the perfect shot. For oh. the train. They'll destroy the fence. Yeah. They'll like get rid of it. And uh, there's, uh, there's a video that went on, was on Twitter the other day where for some reason, a tra- like a train carriage needed to be transported in public, like on, in a, on like a truck. Yeah. And there was just, there was like, it was like a zombie movie. There was these dudes sprinting behind this truck, trying to get pictures of it. <laughs> I don't, in traffic, in traffic. <laughs> I don't understand. Uh, don't these exist every day? Aren't they like? There, yeah, so, yeah. And so, like, I got on this. I got on the sleeper train, and on my video, you can see, dude. It's it's like the paparazzi came out to watch these two trains dock, and they're like they're like fighting over. Uh, they're like fighting over each other to get the I shot. Get, it's I insane. They these are, are these they are, are just people off. who are into like what's the shit where you're into like planet sized cartoons. What the fuck? Giant. I chest? know what you're talking about. What's that? So it's just, they're just. Imagining it's like a big penis, <laughs> right? Yeah. That's what, what do you think? I think this tension simple, come from? Though. What? Where did this tension come what from? Yeah. They, no, no, this is a fetish. This up? What were you no. talking about? You were saying tra- you, you were comparing trans penises. You've brought up a lot of weird shit today. I wanted to tell you that. Bring I it don't up. Know. You. I feel like Japan is a weird place. It's like I'm yeah. being normal. This this is helping like me. Japan? This is helping. Hold on. Oh, helping me understand why there were so many model trains at the culture culture zone. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. They just like a lot of trains. It's, uh, it's 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 yeah. That's why it's right next to the porn section because they can go through the train and then they go to the porn section afterwards because they're already bricked up. <laughs> Easy transition. I like <laughs> yeah. that. I like that. It's the the, the, de- the demographics, believe it or not, overlap very heavily. <laughs> this is my. This is you, what I like about Japan. Probably this. Yeah. Oh, what the the porn and the probably trains? the the deep ties between porn and trains. <laughs> I I don't. I'm trying to think of an answer to that question that isn't like an incredibly simple. Like the well, food is good or yeah, you like the food. Yeah. It was amazing. Any food have surprised you or anything that you didn't expect to like that you did like? Mm. Have you tried any like new like Japanese dishes? I haven't anything? gotten weird. I've only tried the things I know I like because I'm that's how I am. Sperm sack. The sperm sack from Should the I fish. Call? You like yeah. that? Yeah. It was it was dece. Yeah. How the fuck do you eat that and think it's what? decent? Uh, it did. It's complimentary if you're bisexual. They just bring it to your table. I, it's true. I got it for free, and it, they put it, they set it down in front of me, and I saw. I, I I just see something that looked to me looked generally interesting and appetizing, and then my oh. friend uh, who was with us, uh, he he tells me what it is, and then at first I have like an uh, I have like an aversion, mm. yeah. and I'm like I'm like. And then I was thinking about well, just a minute ago I was excited to eat this, so it shouldn't change anything. And then, uh, right, and right. then I tried it. It was like, yeah, it was pretty good. That's why, like a lot of the time in Japan, I'm just, I'm like, don't, don't ask what it is. I just, just eat it. Yeah, just I eat just it, I eat it, yeah. eat it first and find out later because when I found out it was sperm, 
like fish sperm sack. I mean, yeah. I didn't like the taste initially, but then when I found it out, it just made it, <laughs> it just put yeah. me off even more. Uh, I tried some fish, maybe you can help me out. I don't remember what it was called, but it was like a long yellow thing and it was like really hard and like the texture was like bumpy. And then I chewed it and it tasted like was I was- Is this a uh, sushi place? Yeah. Was it like, would, it, would you say it's comparable to like nails, like toenails? No, it was like chewing erasers, like rubber. What, oh. what is the thing that you're talking about? Uh, is this, uh, like, uh, what is it? Fish, uh, the, like fish monk fins. Fish. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Is it the monkfish where they dry it and it's really chewy? I think so, yeah. It's like the Stupid. skate, maybe? Yeah. yeah. It literally has the same consistency as toenails. Yeah. And it's like a little bit salty as well. So mm, it's right, kind of- like it's, toenails. It's yeah. kind of what you imagine toenails <laughs> would taste like. And you can, and as soon as that's in your that's, mind- That's kind of what like when, when we all used to live together, Ludwig would come home after a long day and I'd, <laughs> you know, toenails. I'd get going. Yeah. It's kind of like edamame. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's an appetizer in France. It's a whole culture thing. Let's not be insensitive. <laughs> what are some other pet peeves of Japan then? The the I think the thing I was explaining or the thing I was trying to get across when I made my tweet before the before the weebs came for me okay. was that I, I think it is not a very simple system to access when you like touch down for the first time, like for, mm -hmm. for getting on the train, because you're you're immediately struck with all of these different logos for all of these different types of trains yeah, and yeah, passes. Yeah. And it's not very clear to you that the cards might do something differently or different or that they might functionally be the same. Yeah, yeah. And I think in comparison to a lot of places where like, I, I think the best case scenario now, I don't think it's weird to have like a transport card, mm -hmm. uh, but I think the most ideal scenario is a few cities, you go to the train and you tap on with like whatever debit card you have. I have yeah, my, like yeah, my American contact list debit card and I can like tap onto the train yeah. in London, which is to be clear is not better than the trains here. Yeah. Like, I don't think the underground is better, but yeah, like no, that no, one no. aspect of it is really, really simple. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Yeah, because I think they've, uh, I wouldn't say over-engineered, but they've definitely like the way the train system here is structured is sometimes overly complicated. Uh, I, uh, I took my uh, wife's parents around the other day mm -hmm. and we had to go to like a city that was like next to Tokyo. So I thought living in Japan, I would have no problems with the train at all. But even just figuring out the ticketing system to get from one city to another, sometimes you need to buy two separate tickets. You need to buy one ticket oh, to get- Limited to, Express. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, God, yeah. Shit. Yeah, you need to buy one ticket to get to the place you want to go to. And then if you take a special train, then you need to like plan ahead and make sure you get another extra special ticket for that specific train. I need yeah. to put both tickets into the ticket machine or it won't let you in. It's, it's not oh. explained at all why yeah. you have to do this in, on the English thing. It just tells you that it's like, do you want this ticket or this ticket? And they both don't mean really anything. Yeah. Um, it's very confusing. And, yeah. You know, even now I still like second doubt myself and I'm clicking all the stuff. I'm like, I, yeah, I always click this thing. It must be right. I think it's just like with these weird, like <laughs> even as, as a visitor, you see these weird layers of bureaucracy that seem sure. kind of redundant. Mm. Like even coming in, even coming in with like the QR codes on your customs form, it's like there's two different QR codes for different things that mm -hmm. are everywhere else would oh, yeah, be just sure. one form that you submit yeah and it's and it's not a big fucking deal it's like the trains work you get everywhere they're yeah. on time yeah. it's like it's all of that is immaculate it's like this very like minor complaint of this system that yeah. is like pretty fucking good japan and like user-friendly stuff does not go hand in hand no everything is not user-friendly here a really tiny thing i appreciated it's very very small mm. uh was in the shower there yeah. is like okay so in america uh, there's something called a limiter inside your shower where it, it stops how hot your shower is allowed to go. Okay. And But in order to access it, you need like a special screwdriver mm -hmm. and take it off and go inside. Yeah. Here, it's just a button. And you oh. press the button and you can go past to make it hotter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But in America, you have to like disassemble your shower if you want to oh. make your shower hotter. What the fuck? Uh, I didn't think about that at people, all. A lot of people don't know that that thing even exists and they think that the oh. water just doesn't get hot enough, but you can actually open it up and make it. It's for like to protect elderly people to not oh. burn themselves. But here, you just press the button. You can, so what's the I was maximum like, oh. temperature American showers can go to normally? Uh, it's it's depending on what your limiter is oh. set to. Oh, okay. Like when we, when we moved into the house we used to live in, they were all set to like cold. Oh. And we couldn't figure out why our water was cold, but our sinks were hot. And, oh. and uh, that That's was it. That's so weird. Yeah, I just took cold showers for like two weeks and then <laughs> found out that limiters exist. And I got, I got really good at fixing it because oh. I, I had to do all the ones in the house. I bathed every day. You bathe. I bathe. You're yeah. a bather. Well, because you can, you can, you can, uh, in you Japan, can, you have to bend your knees. 
What do you? Because you have tiny little little baby. No, bath. my best, my best, my best pretty for big. The, for babies. Yeah, I got a pretty big bath. Little baby bath. Not okay. for babies. And <laughs> the best thing it's is, not for, it's not for babies. It's not for babies. <laughs> not for babies. Okay. Uh, okay. And if you say it's for babies, I'm gonna and I'm gonna call my mom. Uh, <laughs> you can you can you can uh, reserve the bath, right? So in my house. I, I, f I just put the plug in, right? And then when I'm going to bed, I'm like, I want the bath to be ready by oh. 7 p like seven a.m. Wait, it's like, it's like you have like an iPad for it? It's something? in my kitchen. It's where like the gas controls are and you just click like uh, reserve. You put the time and the bath every single time, which you just press the fill button, you can choose the exact temperature and how much you want it filled. That is based. I like that and I might move Does, here. It's Doesn't, awesome. <laughs> you wake that's up, that's you, what swings you, the yeah, automatic yeah, yeah. bath. Dude, dude you, you wake up, like, imagine you're tired of shit. The perfect bath is made for you every single time and it's there. Doesn't solve the issue of like the really small baths here though. Well, which my, is, my which is what puts me off. Look, you, you, fill that, you fill that shit up with noodles. Every morning, wake up. You got ramen yeah, ready. Yeah, breakfast <laughs> and shower done. You've got you've got like an enormous <laughs> amount got, of food. He's just got a bath. <laughs> <the ramen. laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. when, yeah. when I go to bed, when I go to bed, the answer is I chuck the ramen in. And then when I come in the morning, like hell. You're like making your you're like making your Joe Rogan cold tub TikToks, but you're just like you get your bowl of ramen <laughs> after every workout. <laughs> I have a I have a I'm a tonkatsu fetish, or I like to imagine I'm tonkatsu, or I'm a I'm a no nah, fucking forgot the word. God damn it. No tonkatsu. Yeah. You're right. I'm right? Yeah, tonkatsu. Oh, yeah. So I get in the there. I, I imagine. No, not the broth. The fucking uh, chashu. I like to imagine I'm chashu oh, in a bowl. Okay, and okay, I, okay. It's already over. Let's just move on. <laughs> it was already like kind of a welcome, welcome <laughs> to episode 83 <laughs> of the podcast. <laughs> I, was like, I like watching a car crash in slow motion. Uh, yeah, just okay. Like <laughs> well, uh, wait, what is this? this you, the clothes come off or? Nope, nope. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Do you guys know about this? That I bought Ludwig a, a figure from his favorite anime, Welcome to NHK. And I just they bought. Exist? Yeah. No, that's what I said. I found him like this cool, <laughs> exclusive uh, Japan only figure on eBay. I buy it for, I think, his birthday. And I'm so excited because I like, <laughs> I didn't even know this was his favorite anime. I was secretly asking friends questions what would be a cool gift. Mm -hmm. And it shows up. And Ludwig takes like one look at the box and is like, you can undress her. I'm like, that's. <laughs> and they designed the underside. They, oh, a lot of the figures. It's not. Yeah. Yeah, that. That's not. Yeah, no, especially the, especially, like especially the expensive figures. Normally they do it so uh, either there's a shot of the panty that's very visible mm. or you can just take the uh, clothes off. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I, I, This is a crazy place. That, that's the yeah. thing I'm feeling yeah, right it's now. Fun, is that, but I love yeah. it. I do love being here. It's, I, I it's feel awesome. like you discover something new like every time you come yeah, here. Yeah. Like we've, yeah. we've lived here for like three and a half years and we still haven't seen all of the crazy shit that you go down, that goes down. I just like public transport. I'm like addicted to just going yeah. on the have fucking train. Have you tried like, have you tried going to like the different types of vending machines you can get here? Cause you, you can get a vending machine for like almost anything. Oh, I should have sent you the weird vending machine place in Akihabara. They yeah. sell like uh, cockroaches and dog uh, food. Yeah. Little minerals and, and uh, crud yeah, and yeah, coins. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah and uh, used, uh, coins. <laughs> used, used coins. panties as well. They sell yeah. those no, as well. No way. Yeah. No yeah. At the vending way. machine? Yeah, yeah, vending who's hitting well. the vending machine? For, <laughs> who's contributing? <laughs> I don't like, know. How are they, like, <laughs> that makes more sense to me. That makes more sense to me. Because because there's probably like a broker and like and, and women can probably just mail them in. They make there's it super guy, easy. Guy, convenient. Yeah, yeah. But then somebody at the end of the no, fucking... The thing, if you shake the machine, you can actually get two to fall out. <laughs> Here's where the scientists who make the sense come in, right? Yeah. So they've been perfecting the, the, the oh. formula. At the end of the, <laughs> do you know what? I mean? How do you verify they're real? You can't. How do I not know that Aiden's panties? It's like are in there's there. a little tag on it. It's like Gore-Tex certified, you know? <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's signed. Yeah, yeah. They have the. You'll, you'll see the Jordan logo. Yeah, that. yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I got in the. <laughs> <laughs> I got the Adidas cue for my fucking used panties on my, oh, on my so phone. Cool. Oh my god! But yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. I just know they exist. I've uh, never tried. I've, I've never, for, for the record, I've never tried it out myself. Archie <laughs> edited, so he's saying that I, I did try. It. <laughs> I've yes, tried that. Yeah. that right. Oh good. I'm trying to like. I'm oh, trying to yeah. explain the the. <laughs> <laughs> The worst bit right now is this is this thing that we can, we're coming to Japan and we're not going home. <laughs> not that we're not going home, but we won't make it back. We won't make it back because we're <laughs> we're taking back what's ours with with the blunder buses. And you're, I, look, you're coming into this bit. This real is late. it's it's, it's, uh, it's 
I, I feel like I'm I, way too white to be a part of this. I I, 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 no, that's the thing. You're just white enough. You're no, just that's, <laughs> I, that's the problem. It looks bad for optics. Uh, you guys are brand risks. Uh, we're, ta- we're, ta- we're taking it back. No, no, we're taking we're it back. Making it home. No, we're not oh making God. it home, Connor. We're oh st- God. Well, I'm, I'm, I am home. I'm here. And you're, and you're our leader. How do you oh feel God. about tricorder hats? Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, man. No opinion. So what's uh, what's like what's your what's been your favorite thing about Japan so far? And <laughs> How can we go from that to? I'm, I'm just, sorry. I'm no, try, we should I'm pivot. We should move. pivot. You're right. I'm we, just trying right. to uh, take the heat off of you. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to make sure. You want to make sure my brother is correct? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, 7-Eleven baller. I wake up every morning, get breakfast, just eat a little uh, sure. rice ball. Sure, that's been uh, fucking sick. Yeah, um, you have 7-Eleven in uh, America, though, right? It's different. <laughs> it's different. <laughs> don't say don't say that. Like, <laughs> like you don't it's know. It's an American you, brand. Yeah, it's an American Just, brand, yeah. right? That's, yeah. that's where we go to get slapped in the face. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> we got, like, the, we got, like, the, big, the big slurpees now. That's you know like, what you guys don't have is the, the, the pill that looks like Dr. Mario's pill that makes your boner really hard. Ooh. We have those we, by the fucking... It's not just called Viagra? You, you, no, 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 no. It's very different. It has a rhino on it. Uh, the branding is insane. They're like it's like holographic pills, like they're like metallic, and That's they're scary. huge. Like That's I, scary. they're bigger than like fish oil pills. This what? is real. Yeah, it's sick. And, I don't you, know about this. And you can go into like gas it's stations sick? and Seven Eleven. Yeah, it's tight as fuck. And you can you can <laughs> take the pill if you can swallow it. If you are a warrior, you can if you can fit it. And then apparently you just have the coolest boner of all time. Yeah, you have the rhino of boners. So when we go in the onsen together, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna be like, <laughs> Dad, guys, you're not meant to be we'll hot. Have, we'll have four. You're not, it's not a competition. We'll have four placebo and one rhino pill. And, <laughs> all right, okay, all right. And we'll, okay. we'll see who peeks out of the water. <laughs> you're like wearing tattoos. You're like, man, I think they kicked me out of the onsen. I'm like, no, I'm I'm not the tattoos. That's actually. I, 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 I think you're rock solid, dude. I'm gonna be popping one off the placebo and just be like, I, I probably took it. I probably. <laughs> it, <laughs> you're it, it, it just sees a coffee shop that's really good to work at and thinks he took it. He just gets the biggest <laughs> bar. He, he's ah. I, I thought uh, this is gonna make okay. That you, this is gonna make my answer seem even more like oh Japan. I want to live here. Like mm, right. you know that. any any that. foreign <laughs> culture. Yeah, because I'm I'm I. They make fun of me rightfully so because every time I go anywhere, I'm like I want to live here, and and it, just anywhere I okay. visit. Because every place is so interesting, right? It's like a, there's, I don't know. There's yeah. A, yeah. There's Have you so lived anywhere but America, though? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I uh, I'm from Canada originally, and then I. <laughs> oh, bro. <laughs> bro. Fuck. Yeah. Come, come I, on, I, man. I've never come seen a, I've never I, seen it look like that on a man ever. On. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Canada. He's like, he's like, no, I used to live in NorCal. So yeah, <laughs> Canada's Canada. It's very foreign. <laughs> No and comment. Then, no comment. I, and then yeah, I lived true. in I lived in Leeds for a year when I was a kid. Okay. okay. Yeah. So that's you that's started with the Leeds. Yeah. 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 The Leeds. And then uh, you know, and that's it. That's it. That's it for living. Mm. Okay. Uh, and then well, I rounded as well. Yeah. Yeah. I obviously there's a giant leap when you don't. It's yeah. like a different language, right? That's like the ma- the biggest one. I mean, Canadian to America, that's a different language. Yeah, huge right? jump. Had to work on it for a while. Got most <laughs> yeah. of it bullied out of me. So. One, thing, one thing I thought would be a lot more important was uh, before I came, Connor was like, so, because he was helping me uh, get a place that we could record the first episode. Yeah. Here, so the episode that played last week. Yeah. And, uh, and he was like, hey, so it's like customary that when you come here, you give a gift. Um, yeah, for the people who are letting you use their property. For sure. Yeah. And so I was like, oh, fuck, like, I got to get, I got to figure out a gift. I'm like, what, what's like a good gift? He's like, well, you know, wine's a good gift. I'm like, okay, okay. So I go out and uh, we bought like an expensive bottle of wine in America, which oh, I then just didn't pack. Uh, so I'll I, drink it when I come and out. I, and I, it's for you. And so it'll be my gift to you because oh, I assume yeah, I send. And, uh, <laughs> and, and, and I assume I send to your mother. And uh, and so I, I forget it. I'm like, we get here. I'm like, all right, we have to go get a bottle of wine. Yeah, like, yeah. So I asked you, like, where can I get wine? And you gave me a place. Uh, it was kind of far, not really far, but like you had to walk there, blah, blah, blah. And uh, and we go and I, it, it was the point I'm trying to convey is that it was kind it was a of hassle. It's a, a hassle. massive hassle. And yeah. I was like, hey, but I'm trying to do this right. I'm yeah, 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 respectful. Yeah. And then we show up to the house. Yeah. That we're actually recording at. <laughs> and the dude opens up. He's like, yo, what's up, bro? Hey, daps me up. I'm like, yo, hey. And we walk in and it's a bunch of crypto guys. What the and, fuck? And I'm like, I'm like, and they're very nice. Don't get me wrong. But right. uh, I'm like, so I brought you wine. They're like. 
dude, fucking tight. Do we have a bottle opener? And they're like, nah, nah. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, I'm holding it. I'm holding it like a fucking dumbass. And I'm like, so here's your wine. Here's your traditional <laughs> well, okay. Japanese and I'm like, gift. Is Connor pranking me? Is no, that no, like no, a sir, funny I, joke? So obviously uh, what happened was is that you'd asked me to if, if there's any place that we could film in, uh, or you could film the yards in Tokyo. And I was like, well, you asked me very late, which is like really tough in Japan to film anything anywhere. It takes it takes weeks to get permissions. Also, anything. space is really hard to find. Space here is as hard well. to find. And, yeah. uh, but uh, we, I, I knew Alex, and Alex does a lot of stuff with real estate. And you were just looking for a house, and obviously you can't just go into someone's property and just film something normally. Like the, you know, there is what? normally, yeah, you just walk into their house and just film. I know it's crazy, right? So I was like, if anyone can get it done, it's, it's Alex. And I didn't know who whose house it was <laughs> that you were renting, right, yeah. or using. It was so, just so funny because we walked in, and it yeah. was like. Uh, it was like the meme of like men can actually live like this, and it's like a TV and a chair. Yeah, it, it no. was like oh. it was like, and, and don't get me wrong. Well, you got the perfect. Don't kind of get people. me wrong. Yeah. The chair was nice as fuck. So, okay, so. but and the, and the floors were heated, but they had only what they needed. Right, right. And now right. they have a bottle of wine that I imagine they'll have to smash open. Well, so initially, I, you had someone else's house. Yes, uh, that you were going to yes. record at. We initially, and that, had a different house. That was like mm -hmm. some, uh, I, from my understanding, was a, a an older gentleman who had a dog and was a bit more. Uh, let's say put together. It had more furniture. Yeah, say. we ended up switching houses. Had a bald bottle was, opener. Was good. Yeah. Bottle yeah. Opener. And um, well, normally, yeah, in Japan, obviously, there's just a gift giving culture, especially if you work with someone and they let you film for free. Mm. You normally just bring a gift. Like, that's just what you do. And I didn't know if you're going to get a stuffy guy. The gift is my fucking dope ass rhymes. I'm going to say. Well, there you go. On the roof. And uh, yeah, I well, guess. What, you were they, what were they yeah. doing while you were filming? Vibing, chilling. Just, just vibing. Did they watch you record? No, they, no, no, no. Uh, no. They were very nice. Living their life. They were working. I yeah, was worried that you were going to get a super strict Japanese dude who was just going to watch you the whole time. Oh. Well, yeah. we were we were on a rooftop in a very nice neighborhood talking nice. about how we're not going to make it home <laughs> and how we're going nice. to take back what's ours. Uh, which well, I, th I don't think the, yeah, the tenants were going to make it home with the crypto prices, right? They're probably just like, dude, we're, we're going to make something. Dude, for that's it. why they're living like that, man. They, they've had to sell they everything. Can't, they to can't the buy house. any furniture. No. <laughs> <laughs> that's the just the Do you left. take a Bitcoin? <laughs> <laughs> Where's the Sumi Musan hamburger machine? Is that around here? <laughs> no, no, it's it's Dogecoin, right? So, uh, you please, can I have food? I love American impressions. I think they're the funniest fucking thing uh, on why? the planet. I don't know why. I think because like whenever someone does American, they can't not say hamburger. Yeah, like they're true, always yeah. like hamburger. Yeah, there's so like, many that's defaults. What I, that's what I do it's to like you, that, I get it. Or or Valley Girl accents. Mm, it's yeah. it's always like a few yeah. options. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. cool. you have to to do it like a true American act. You have to sound stupid. Like you also kind of you kind well, of package <laughs> it in with sounding dumb. I, I do you? Yeah. I yeah. Think so. yeah. You even have when to, I, even mm. when I I think my version of this is doing like a southern impression. Right. 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 And it's usually like I reckon I'm slow too. Well, you announce well, they, everything. They that's, that, that's a good thing. Yeah, they say that the Southern accent is uh, pretty close to British in terms of the way that they talk. Like, and not, not so the way you it ruined them. I guess yeah, we ruined it because it's more. If you think about how the whole the history went, obviously mm. the the more rich colonial kind of people stayed in the oh, South, right? Yeah, so that kind of speaking comes. Uh, I like the Southern accent though. Yeah, man, I, it's I, I like. Yeah, nice. give, give me your really best. Thick. Give me. Let's let's hear a little. Rip bit. it, rip I, it, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. Oh, that was great. Oh, okay, okay. Like, that, was that, was like, that was solid. That was solid. Like, I, I think that it's we cool. should tell him. So, like, what, what I what I liked about Japan uh, yeah. was uh, <laughs> the southern accent in Japan. Right? <laughs> that's an Osaka accent, right? Thai British guy lives in Japan doing a southern accent. That's that's a thing I didn't think I'd ever see. I watched this. Uh, the category. There's Oops. like this this mini doc piece on this guy from China who just right. fell in love with like Western movies growing growing up, and he really loved like the cowboy yeah. sort of like live out on the farm uh, yeah. vagabond lifestyle, yeah. right? And he moved to the U.S. and became a farmer and like built his cowboy That's life sick. and has this like authentic Texas accent yeah. and just like lives alongside other Texas farmers. And they're like, yeah, he sounds like he's grown up here his whole life. And he's like grew up the first 20 years of his life in China. That's just Sandy Cheeks from SpongeBob. <laughs> just, just the That's Chinese. literally all that is. I, yeah, I mean, What's that's up? cool. I, I like it when people are like, you know what? My country, yeah. it's not for me. It's not for I'm me. I'm just going to go somewhere else and make my own life and they fit in.
All right. So, so we never we never got to where you wanted to move to. What's like your tier list of like the countries you want to move to? Since everywhere you go to, you want yeah. to move there, right? Because everywhere would be cool, right? I I don't. You guys actually did it, don't you? Think there's other places out there where it would be interesting to forge oh, for a new sure. life yeah, in? For sure. Yeah, yeah. I think there's like there's those versions where it's like everywhere would be interesting in some capacity, and then there's like the places that I think would actually long term work out. Uh, I like Scandinavia a lot. But right. I and that's I feel like that's a pretty pretty like Chill boring place. answer. He hates Sweden, even though he's Swedish. He's allowed. Who's Swedish? He's allowed to Ludwig. Ludwig. Oh what? He's Ludwig Swedish. Ludwig. Oh, get over it. Yeah. All right. Pick, so pick you're, a nationality. You're right? in yeah. an <laughs> you're in an onsen and you shit yourself. Okay. Well. Okay. okay. What, what's what's up with the shitting? Why yeah. are you shitting it's, yourself in an onsen? Is because you're so relaxed. No. No. <laughs> yeah, no. You're so relaxed. Like, and by not? this and by this point, you've made it yours. It's it's <laughs> yeah. it's back. And and so to, and you're like, uh, what has helped <laughs> help me in Japanese? Tasukete. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not telling you that. Okay. I don't, I don't need to burden. Tasukete. I don't want you to burden. Tasukete. <laughs> And you're just like, ah, I shouldn't have sold you that. Everywhere, right? On the why towel. You, why are you obsessed what? with shitting everywhere? I'm not obsessed with anything, bro. I'm just saying that's the worst thing that could happen, probably, in public. And I want to know if the Japanese people got my back. Absolutely not. <laughs> Do Americans have your back if you shit yourself in public? There's a chance, yeah. If, I, a, if, if I've shit my pants on the train next to Aiden and we're in Los Angeles, California, he'd and I'm like, help me, stranger. He'd be like, okay, yeah, could, I'll could help you. you. Could yeah, you that's because I know you. Like, you know, it's the first time you ever see a white guy and he comes in the onsen with you. You're like, hey, don't be nervous. <laughs> and he just starts <laughs> shitting himself in the onsen. You're like, and that's your only impression can of you white imagine, dudes. Can you imagine? You're like, you go home to your <laughs> wife that night. You're like, yeah, Americans just shit in the onsen. Yeah, and that, and he, he's going to seem like an insane personal friend. <laughs> so he's like, dude, these Americans just keep shitting like, in the onsen. They just keep the shit in the onsen. They thought that amazing. Like, yeah, some guys shit the on, uh, shit themselves on the fucking train. Like, what's, what's up with that? I think you'd be on like, what's, what's I think you'd that? be on like yeah, national TV. Right? <laughs> I think that would be like, I think that would be a war crime for them. <laughs> <laughs> they report on it. This is why we uh, can lean into it. Like, like, yeah, Americans don't take public baths because you you shit when you take a bath. <laughs> yeah, just, there's so much is, burger. The fact, that the fact that that's why you bathe in the thought. comfort I'm, in the I'm, comfort of your own home because you take you take a shit in the bath yeah. after that's work. Right. That's right. We do it the way we want. This could be like our drop bears. If yeah, we, this could be like <laughs> we spread a rumor yeah. about our kind. That that is just a total detriment <laughs> to ourselves. Yeah, that doesn't make us impressive or cool, but it makes us formidable. No, I'm just no. curious why you want to limit test Japanese people by shitting. Because you're like, <laughs> hey, why are you trying to break these poor people? Who can't <laughs> no, just get no, 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 no. It doesn't have to do with Japanese people. It has to do. You can do this test anyway. That's right. You That's can do right. this test anywhere. We just happen to be in Japan. Yeah. So think about so that. Have okay. you done this in other places? Have I done it ever? Where no. do you, which country do you think it would work the best in? <laughs> Yet, like, I would receive the most aid. <laughs> from <laughs> 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 just, uh, <laughs> top 10 countries to shit Probably yourself Probably Germany, because they're into it, right? <laughs> <laughs> that is a sweeping, a sweeping assumption. <laughs> That so is, I'm sorry to all the Germans out there. Do you have any German fans who watch? Yeah. Probably. Uh, no, that's a thing. It's like, and they got Vor cafes there everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> no, look, I just I like to, to think of the extremes of things that can happen, and you know, I don't know, man, it's crazy out there. I'm not going to answer. Are you still you. not hungry? You don't want I, anything? I am hungry actually, but I, I'll I'll do it after. One, one hamburger, please. All right. <laughs> I'm never going near, the, near yeah. you in an onsen. Yeah, <laughs> you got to say five feet or, away. Or a train. Every time I see you in or white. <laughs> every time I see you in white, I'm like, I'm like, yo, red alert. Red. Oh Something's about to happen. Warning people to get oh. off. <laughs> the I next get like one. the fucking spidey senses. I'm like, don't sit next to him right now. Immediately walk into the next car. Like, yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's about to go down. I want to. I want to ask this before it's before I can never ask it again. But uh, if you, how okay, aliens come to Earth. They're mad. All right, they're all pissed. Right. Give us your best anime. Give us the best you got, or we will vaporize this shit. Right. What do you submit to the aliens to show that we are worth a society to exist? Attack on Titan. It's it's easy. You easy. think so? Yeah. You think they're you think they're basic? <sighs> 
You think an alien's gonna see anime for the first time and be like, dude, this seems too normy. <laughs> Maybe. You gotta hear that you gotta hear that child you, stuff. You show yeah. him a fun <laughs> <laughs> oh, so the case builds. <laughs> Look who breaks it up. No. Con- uh, Connor's like, yeah, you know, I think they'd be in that <laughs> shit. Like you're just implying the alien just wants to fucking weird right away. <laughs> I do like that. I know That's what kind of show giving him credit, right? Like right. you say Attack on Titan, it's like, okay, normie bait. What do you got? I don't know. I don't, what are you watching enough anime? Uh, JoJo. I'll give him JoJo. I knew you JoJo. 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 Let's give him JoJo's. Hmm. Okay, interesting. I what like would you that. give him? What would you give him? I think you give him, uh, I mean, King of the Hill. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Because it's like, it's like, what's it slice of life called? Slice of life. Slice of life. <laughs> no, no, no. There's a, no, there's a Japanese word for it. You piece of shit. No, slice of no. life. No, isn't there like a word? Slice of life. Slice of life. Yeah. And it's a it's a slice of life. And I was It's like asking what the French word for cafe is. <laughs> <laughs> I genuinely thought no, I, th- I thought it was like a genre. Like uh, there's different shonen? types. Shonen, that's a that's slice a slice of life that's is a genre type. Yeah. Got it. It's where like nothing happens. Right, right, right. Shonen is the Japanese mouth. word for slice of life. Is that true? No, confirm. No. Translator, no. confirm. No, it's not. He says no. Shonen's a young boy. Yeah. No. <laughs> Why do you guys have a, a n- n- ninja turtle? Oh, oh well, uh, last guest who came on. Yeah. Last, uh, who, who was an American who oh, cool. uh, gifted us uh, a Ninja Turtle. He's figure. like, this is this is what this is my. He's anime. in the harem between all the big titty anime ladies. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's, he's enjoying his time. <laughs> Raphael's Holy living shit, his Leo, dream. Look at these boobs. <laughs> <laughs> and we still got like LeBron James. Yeah, we've over there. James. <laughs> where, where where's oh, he? He's LeBron, here, here's LeBron James. Oh, nice. He's chilling. <laughs> yeah, he's chilling. <laughs> where did where did you grow up? I grew up in England. Okay, what part? Uh, Brighton. I mean, like, like part, part, like zoom you out. Know what, what's 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 pop, pop. Just zoom out. You don't south. know where Brighton south? is. South. south. Thank south. you. Come on, it's right. Ah. All, all the big YouTubers live there. That's where PewDiePie lived. Really? That's where Jacksepticeye lived. I mean, I lived there before it was cool. So you know. Right, right. <laughs> How old are you? Uh, thirty-two. <sighs> Brother. Bro, bro, are you thirties? Yeah, I'm thirty-two. Fuck yeah, man. Yep, yep, God yep. yeah. Yeah. Thank still, God. Right? Doesn't it feel still good? Shitting himself. Oh, good. Still shitting himself. Still shitting himself. 25. 25. Uh, 26, yeah. Oh, you're 25? You're 26? I'm 26. Oh, oh, this sucks. Everyone wow, you're so old. Fucking you're young. young. Yeah, it's, yeah. Uh, the industry gets like it like just keeps staying at the same like zone and you get older and you're like, fuck, this fucking blows. Yeah. Like, but, uh, you know, see, that's the solidarity that 32-year-olds have. I have demonstrated that I am not a fun person to hang around with, but given my well, fascination with pooping. <laughs> but he, but Garnt was like, my man. My man. <laughs> that's right. Oh, we yeah. put, it all together. put it all aside. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> for, a bit of, for a bit of joy. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll allow one public yeah. shit. I'll, I'll allow it. I'll We're allow in it. there. <laughs> what brings people in their early 30s together? <laughs> <laughs> Hypothesizing <laughs> what could go wrong <laughs> on the train. Well, no. you know, if you... Uh, when you turn 40 in Japan, you have to have a mandatory colonoscopy every year. Yeah. Really? Mandatory? mandatory That's so yeah. nice. Why? Yeah. <laughs> Don't know. Why is it mandatory? mandatory? Like, yeah. It's just when you get older, the thought of having something up your ass gets more appealing. Yeah. Wow. So, so in I'm Japan. In. So it is thoughtful. Yeah. So so in Japan, you have to do an annual health checkup where they literally yeah. like rank your health, like they mm-hmm. grade it. Mm. Uh, every single part of for your, your health. employer. You have yeah, to. For do. your employer. For your they employer? Need, they need to know. Yeah. yeah. And uh, at 40, yeah, you do uh, colonoscopy. And it's mandatory. You, you so go in like this conveyor belt kind of thing. You're, you're <laughs> in and out. Uh, no, genuinely, you, you, they make you wear a robe. You go in 20 minutes, you get like blood pressure. They take blood injection. It's probably uh, the one place you would shit yourself and people would help you. Yeah. Yeah, we've, <laughs> right. found it. we've actually now found it. Yeah. That's kind of cool. And then you, you get graded afterwards. They're like, dude, your liver is a B, your this blood is a C. This sounds literally like ergo proxy. Yeah, it is, but it's kind of hype because it's uh, it's kind of cool. Yeah, and such a niche. And also, if you, yeah, I got if you those have, two. Uh, if you have too many employees that are overweight, your company gets uh, taxed more. No yeah. shit. Wow. Yeah. Can what? I can I tell you about me and Aiden's dream? And it's we and, no. Is, is this the dream? No, 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 no. different dream. <laughs> we, we'll make it back. I but but this before is a we shed do, dream or yeah. this is a, hold on, no, hold on. Stop, I need to up. Shut, stop talking. So I'm shitting myself. <laughs> <laughs> Aiden's refusing to help me until I call him cute. No, um, we 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 got off the train. We started just traveling around in Japan, and we and we shit our pants. No, I was like. We we looked at each other and Aiden was just like, "Give me a fucking briefcase, bro." And I was like, "Yeah." And I was like, "We want to become salary man." <laughs> <laughs> me and Aiden want to become chain smoking, binge drinking salary men. Why? 
because bad. it's like it's like badass. It's raw. It's, it's raw. It's, it's, it's like it's, it's like depressing. You know how there's yeah. the void, right? Of like death and like the end of your life and stuff. This is like a living void, and it's kind of me and Aiden. For some reason, we yeah. fuck, think it's fucking cool. Yeah, I'm it is that. You're pretty spot on. It, it is a it is a void where you you just you're a slave to the company. Have you not yeah. wanted to be salary man? Absolutely if not. you if I wanted to sell my soul to a company and just lose a part of my soul every time I wake up, probably yeah. Um, why do you guys think it's cool? Because you have like your necktie. I want to get to my I want to get to my really short lunch break and then just smoke cigarettes instead well, of may, eating. Maybe you were right. Maybe you were born in the wrong country. Because <laughs> coming saying. like if you grew up here and you told your parents, I want to be a salary man. <laughs> <laughs> I want to live the dream, mom. <laughs> well, your kids here don't even want to be salary men. They be <laughs> is it they, they get kind of ridiculed, right? The idea of a salary man. Oh no, like, no, no, that's, no. The, that's like the go to. Yeah, like that's what you do. There's, yeah, there's no, there's no, there's no we'd be respected. Right, we'd be respected. I was reading because I was you reading get, you about get like it. lifetime and, contracts. And it was like, too. do you have to drink a lot to be a salaryman? So, and this article was like, yes. And all, often, if you don't outrank your your superiors, you have to drink. Yeah, and it's yeah. like there's just the concept of rank in general. Which it, you it, have to outdrink yeah. your superiors every time. That's just oh. it's, it's becoming less common now. It is, it is less, it happens a lot less, especially because kind of COVID. COVID kind of killed it all. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. So it doesn't happen nearly as much, but it still happens. Them health scores. <laughs> it's yeah. hard to maintain yeah. if you're drinking That's why they have the health scores, man. Right. Because a lot of people, uh, they die, especially salary men, they die from just overwork. I mean, overwork, companies. yeah, also like depression. It's actually very sad. At but 55, yeah. and, I'll, and I'll have straight Ds every year on my health yeah, report card. We'll be together forever. Forever. That's It'll be me and you. Be It'll be me and you. The company pay more tax? <laughs> Fuck yeah. 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 Fuck them, right? Yeah. Fuck but also... But also I live and die for them. <laughs> <laughs> I, I will do anything they say. Yes, please. <laughs> yeah, and that's the dichotomy of us. What? I have like I have versions of this of this life that I imagine in different places. Like like in in China, I'm I'm queuing League of Legends and eating cup noodles <laughs> at the PC at the PC cafe You're every night. Part of and every I'm, single and I'm, and, I'm, and I'm hard stuck diamond two, <laughs> and I'm and I'm fucking. Broke. And you're playing Crossfire on your break, even though it's like not helping you get to your Yeah, goals. Crossfire isn't helping me with League, but it's still, I've got a lot of skins and time put into it. <laughs> yes, sir. I'm, I'm, there's, Gen these are all the different dreams I have. Genuine question. Do you hate yourself? <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's Do you know what? Thing. If you fantasize about being a salary no. man or playing <laughs> League, I'm like, bro, is, are you good, man? Are you good? Good? No, I, I have a theory. I have a theory. Because I had I had these goals for a long time. I had goals in my life. And I I and then, and then you started the podcast. And I <laughs> and I kind of yeah. I kind of achieved them and I was like, well, what? What do I have now? Yeah, and it was like the empty, the void, the void, the salary man, the void. void. It's but if I, but if I was, <laughs> yeah, if I was a salary man. I don't, I don't have to think about my goals anymore. That's right. I just, I just work for the. I, I do understand I, the appeal of like I don't have to think. Like, yeah, I just turn up. Yeah, and I do my part. The living void. <laughs> yeah, and there's a, there's a beauty like that. in that, and yeah. we're romanticizing it. But also, part of us, I think, we would press that button. Me and Aiden, not you guys. He you guys which are pussies. Which he button? Press yeah, it. I was like, am I, am I the shitting I, myself? I <laughs> no, yeah. well, that comes with it. I, and no, all no. salary men eventually shit their pants on the on the train. Go, 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 go. Okay, <laughs> it's really late. It's in you, go, you guys got back from the bar. Mm -mm, you're not making it home. <laughs> So so wait, which button are we talking about? The button to become salary oh, men. Okay. Detroit oh, become salary okay, men. Okay, okay. So you should you should check out this. Uh, uh, Instagram account called uh, Shibuya Meltdown because that's mostly like salary men who have just like either gotten ridiculously drunk in Shibuya in public, uh, or some of them maybe oh, just really? shit themselves. You know? just, Dude, we it's saw just, it's just an Instagram account of like people who've passed out on the floor. Yeah, I saw a picture of that and it yeah. was like in the middle of the street, and I was like, that's haunting. In we a way. saw a guy yesterday. We were walking through uh, Akihabara. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Akihabara. <laughs> right. I, I, blew, there. I, I sort of got there. Uh, it, you know where I mean. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but we saw a guy who uh he was literally like he was he, he you know those uh they're not fences but they're like poles along the side of the sidewalk yeah, in some yeah. sections and the gap between them is pretty tiny and he like fit he's he's fitting himself through them in the middle of a crowd and then just falls but half halfway through the poles and it's just laying there. So his ass is elevated, stuck in the fence, but his body is hanging out with his backpack on the ground. And like, and two people, God bless their soul, go over to help him up. 
He could have shit in his pants. He didn't have shit he in his could. pants. They would have backed up if he <laughs> yeah, said that. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and they go near him, and he's like, uh, and he's just, no, no. And he like worms his way out, and then and then just stumbles into the street. Like, I, it is rare to see someone this intoxicated in public, and wow, he's just like wobbling back and forth. Yeah. yeah. Really? Yeah, if you get pretty late at night. Uh, Interesting. Yeah. yeah, I was like, poor guy. Is yeah. I've seen so many people just literally just fully laid out on the floor, passed out. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Because uh, especially because Japan with their salary men, they have to work to like late all of the time. So, I mean, I remember the first time I came to Japan, I'm like, oh my God, there's like a man with a briefcase walking at like running somewhere at 2 a.m. I was like, that's so cool. And then I kind of realized, oh wait, he's still fucking working at 2 a.m. Oh he's my running God. to a meeting, yeah. man. Wow. And I was like, okay, that's, uh, that's less mm. romantic, uh, romanticized for me. And we now. made Japan look pretty bleak this episode, huh? Yeah, well, hey, I like that because it's like you guys are peeling open the the, the veneer and going, hey, look, it's not all it's cracked up to be. Also, with all Every the positives. Every country's fucked up. Every country's yeah. fucked up. Yeah. Yeah, I have a question for you guys. If you, okay, trash taste ends. Uh-oh. Bye forever. Okay. What do you go back and do? What do you What do you go do? I, was, I did YouTube before. No, they you can't do YouTube. You can't be on YouTube at all. So You're banned. YouTube ends. So you, YouTube well, ends. yeah, because you salary free- member. I shit myself. <laughs> it's the only path. That's what I'm saying. He gets him. He gets back to it's. Oh, it's always back to the salary man. Yeah, life. I have a call knack of the for, voice. Uh, yeah, that's right. I have a knack for identifying the pulsing core of what makes us human, and it's being a salary man. man I, I have no idea what I do. I, really? mean, I didn't really plan. I'm right or die. Do you have like a degree? <laughs> yeah, I have an engineering degree. Yeah, but it's worthless now. I don't remember anything from my you catch up, keep up. Sorry. Yeah, yeah I, I, I could lie. Yeah, I could say I know what I'm doing. What did you study? <laughs> I studied electronic engineering. <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah, That's mechan- a difficult I, degree. What? Like mine wasn't. I don't know what yours is. <laughs> mechanical. He's mechanical. No, he's, he's a lesser <laughs> one. Even, yeah. I yeah. Yeah. even I know this. Even I know this. Civil, no. mechanical, <laughs> yeah. everything oh, else. Oh. <laughs> mechanical. Uh, mechanical is the jack of all trades. You got to learn everything. Yeah, Let's everything. Go and play with your little currents, baby. All right, I'm gonna make a fucking car. <laughs> he found out everything about your degree in 1971. <laughs> and he knows that's true. This, way, this, this is spoken like someone who knows nothing about it. Uh, yeah, fucked. Did you guys oh. go to college? Uh, yeah, I studied finance. Oh, uh, that's nice. That's Which why is, you want to be a salary man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I have creative writing degree, so mine's more of a, of a, a lofty romanticization. Right. His is more a true salary man, which yeah. is cool. Yeah. But yeah, you uh, guys are cool, man. You guys are the cool. The thing you asked the the thing that I like the best about Japan and uh I was walking around today. I think it's the architecture. I, I think I just wow. love walking around and looking at the buildings. I think I think the UK looks so much better than I like think, like if you go to London you see all this like beautiful like uh stones and marble. Yeah. You're like, man, that's so cool. It's all like cohesive. It's cool, Japan, don't get me wrong. It's cool that it's all kind of a mess, but it is a mess. It's like yeah. There's no rules on what you can and can't build. So it's kind of unique. I but at like the same that, time, it's like you might have a house and your neighbor might, might be the biggest cunt and just build like the <laughs> ugliest, most reflective thing on earth. Mm-hmm. And it's just a, a nuisance. Have you just noticed Japan's just like a really aesthetic country? Yeah. Like you've, you've been to a lot of countries, right? And yeah. it feels like Japan especially is just built for taking pictures in different places because everything has a different vibe. You go to like Golden it's Guy. It's like foreign. I think yeah. it's because it's foreign. Like I don't think to, 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 if you ask Japanese people, they're like, what are you, what are you fucking talking about? Tokyo looks like shit. You think so? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, you, people if, eventually, if you, you, you ask, always take it yeah. for yeah. granted if you grow yeah. up there, right? Yeah, because they, they often would like, you know, you travel around, you see all the other stuff that like Europe has, you have a lot more history to yeah. stuff a lot of the time. There's no history to a lot of the buildings in Tokyo. You know, and and when they are, they're demolished. Like the the famous capsule hotel That's that looked what, fucking who, sick. Who was telling me? Somebody was telling me that a lot. Of the average age of a building here like is 30, only like years. thirty yeah. years, and I was yeah. like, that is fucking crazy. Well, that's man. because Japan had like an economic boom in like the nineteen eighties, where and earthquakes. Yeah. Oh yeah. Because earthquakes are super as well. bad here. Yeah. Oh, okay. You're lucky you haven't had one while you're here. There, there hasn't been one for a while. Weird. You know what's funny? We were gone. Oh no, I was gone. But you, there was one uh, in Sokka. a big one in LA for the first. That was my first big first one, big where like one. the room shook and woke yeah. me up. Kind of like riding a wave. Yeah. Weird. Uh, what was what was the number? What was the magnitude? Uh, I think it was lower. It, it had to be deadly, lower than four. But it was enough to be like whoa. Yeah. Apparently yeah. it wasn't there. But it was the first time I'd ever like oh what it's it's happening, which right. was a, kind of a jarring mm-hmm. feeling. Mm-hmm. Is there any? Uh, I was it is because uh, I feel like the last the last big big one was the nuclear disaster as well, right? 
Uh, the is, that, is that the last like huge one? It's the last huge one that caused a lot of damage. One? There's yeah. been a few. Yeah. They've had like really bad landslides and flooding in some areas. Yeah. Japan just can't get a break when it comes no. to natural disasters. Mm. It's pretty fucking bad already. Yeah, I mean, like, I, th I think people here are just, like, used to it. Even, like, what I've been in an earthquake where it shut off my entire power grid from, like, my block, Shit. which was, like, really, really weird. And it didn't even feel that powerful, honestly. It's, it's it like, you know, when when you're in an earthquake, since you experience so much here, you can't, it's weird to say you kind of get used, used to it. it. You're used to it. Yeah. Sure. They're that common? <clears throat> yeah. Oh, wow. it depends. Like, there's there's... There hasn't been one for ages, actually. No. But when I when we first moved here, man, it was like every week that was one. That's yeah. crazy. I didn't uh, know it was that common. <laughs> it, 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 I guess it just comes and goes depending on like how I don't know how I'm not a fucking is it geologist. Plates. Yeah. It's the plates. Is it worse because there's not a lot of regulation around like how the buildings are built? And no, there's stuff? a shit no, no, no. ton. There's oh, there shit is a lot. Regulation. Yeah, and they're constantly updated. So that's why like older buildings need to be torn down a lot of the time. Yeah. Because they, they need to be future proof with <coughs> new technology and stuff. Yeah, uh, if, if you're in a new building, you're pretty earthquake safe here in oh, Japan sure. just because 100%. they get so much. But if you're in like an old creaky wooden building, that's yeah, probably yeah, not yeah. been regulated. Okay. You have something to worry about. We get an old creaky wood building. <gasps> and every day and every day we're, we're, we could be pulled into the void. We but could we, be. And we're taking the risk. And we cigarettes. soak it with cigarette smoke. <laughs> Over and over. This is a depressing life that you seek. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're excited about it. <laughs> You're being a fucking asshole right now. You're being a fucking asshole. You're cool. Yeah. I know. Uh, I know. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, I think what I like the most, what I've been enjoying, and this isn't like a, a Japan specific or Tokyo specific thing, but like it's just such a vast place. It's like insane. Like you will travel like five miles and it's still just like giant buildings with a shitload of people. And I just really, really enjoy being around a lot of people mm, yeah. that I don't know. I don't know why. It's just like I like being in crowds and yeah. the the sheer well, this volume. Is, this is the mega city of that man. You'll, it's yeah. insane. You'll never be able to see you escape a crowd. I and think I that, like it. It's that's very cool. One of the cool things is that the city feels like when you just walk through it. The city feels infinite. Yeah. It's try. It's hard to get a mental map going of yeah. like where you are and mm. like how to find things. Yeah. Cause it's not like Melbourne. It's not on a grid, this you know, <laughs> Dom and, and everybody seating. knows about the grid. That's right. <laughs> Love that grid. Uh, and I, I think that that feeling of it being infinite is so rare. Like, I think there are so few cities that, that capture the, <laughs> yeah, void, the void, the void, if you All will. Right, and man. you're just a cog in the void. Yeah. And we're in our tie and neckties, like kind of like off it's, and like, there's like, it's a little like, loose a stain on like our shirt. <laughs> And we're smoking. Because I got back late last night and I couldn't wash it. <laughs> I couldn't wash it. I gotta cover it up. <laughs> we become a salary man. A weird obsession. No, it's not weird. It's not weird. You, you're you, being weird. You don't get you're it, bro. It's got to get it. Got to right. spend a little more time in Nippon. <laughs> All right, I got to ask Americans, how does it feel walking everywhere? I Good? love it. Bad. Honestly, I love it. Yeah. Right. I, 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 I'm unironically, the public transportation is so safe. I feel the same way as Nick does. It's like, it's just efficient and you like, you can exercise without having to like yeah. set time apart. Yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah. I wish it was like this in LA. LA is a fucking miserable place yeah. <laughs> yeah. For, for traveling. I, th I think one thing I noticed about LA is that you can get really get stir crazy in your own house just because you have to drive. To like, I like when we when we stayed in LA, we had to drive to get to coffee sometimes. Yeah, like Uber Eats like yeah. coffee. That's normal. It's yeah. so annoying. Yeah, to drive to get a fucking coffee. Yeah, it's a, uh, it's everywhere I've a lived pain. in LA, that's been the case. You have to drive pretty much to where you want to go unless you want to walk like a pretty far distance, right? Yeah. Like, just still okay. I think this is this is closer to my uh, my actual idealized life. I was talking about uh, about this with a friend recently. Mm. Is like my non my non salary man dream, <laughs> like my actual right. life that I want. All right, your your ideal life. Yeah. Okay. I, and Firstly, I, actually, you're gonna hate Japan because solo queue here fucking sucks. <laughs> oh yeah. It sucks ass, man. Really? Holy <laughs> shit. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna break your dream right now. <laughs> it is literally no. the worst. No. Server <laughs> you can get in the no. world. No. Say it's true. Wake up. <laughs> yeah, I, I stopped playing like League totally the moment I started playing on this server. I was like, yo, this shit fucking sucks. <laughs> don't, don't break don't break the romanticized painting I have for myself yeah, the, the in my only, head. The only game that I think is good to play here or like alone or like a lot of multiplayer games like Apex because it's huge here. Yeah, I've heard of like you, you go on League of Legends and you have like a Chinese guy shouting at you and then you have a, another guy from like Korea calling you a piece of shit. 
Yeah. And then, you know, you play Valorant and you hear like a Chinese guy on the mic screaming and you're like, what the fuck? <laughs> you need a yeah. break. I'm like, Jesus Christ. Yeah. The, and then they're just stopping all, all the other Asian countries stopping racist to each other over the voice comms. You're like, in English. <laughs> and uh, the guy yeah. from Wales has to be like, everyone chill out. Yeah. Gentlemen, the gentlemen, gentlemen. <laughs> the, the one language you won't hear on Japanese servers here is Japanese. You never fucking hear Japanese. <laughs> because because, because if, you, if you speak Japanese on Japanese servers, it's the one way to get camped or fucking like toxic, but like, Lead yeah, out your lane. Only, Every only, time. Why? Yeah, only Apex is good. Apex is great. Yeah. It's, so, it's huge here. And <laughs> also, it's just one. It's Battle Royale, right? So it's, yeah. you're not teaming with anyone. People, yeah. people do not voice chat here as well. Like it's it's extremely uncommon people to have open mic. Salary man, father's upstairs. Because they don't want. You to. don't want to wake up. Don't want to wake up. Don't want to wake Dad. Don't want to fucking talk. Dad had a tough day at work. Smoking. Dad, I wake Dad up. He's one day closer to the void. <laughs> like, uh, you know how, like, if you played, I don't know, I, no, no one does now, but if you played Overwatch thing, right, you'd get to the higher ranks. And I assume it's the same for, like, Valorant as well. Like, the higher rank you go, the more likely people are to be on voice chat. Yeah. Uh, not like that at all. In Interesting. Wow. Nobody voice chats. Wow. It's yeah. weird. Sorry to break your dream. No, that's okay. That's okay. This is good for me. <laughs> this is good it. for I me. I, my rose-tinted glass is just getting massive cracks in them right <laughs> now. But walk to a coffee. So. You can't. That's you can't. What, that's my dream. That's my actual dream. Is okay, walking okay. walking to everything I need every day. Is that that's my actual dream? Which and it can also be achieved in like New York City. Exactly. Yeah. It doesn't have to do. <laughs> that doesn't have to do with Japan. That doesn't have to do with mm. a, any yeah. particular place. I just I I hate getting in the car to go do basic yeah. shit. Yeah. Every yeah. Day. So is, is uh, out of everything that you have to tear in terms of your perfect living conditions, is that at the top? Yeah. Okay. What else? What else? What is your perfect lifestyle? What's important? Food, food, and PC, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, you know, I, I. No that's wonder why everywhere Nick, you go in the world, <laughs> yeah, you're, you're like, I want to live. This is, this is, this is, is really what I was telling my friend. This is what I was telling my friend when, when, when we were talking about this because we were, we had a similar dream, and I was like, but, but my dream is it, after my, after I work on, on my laptop at some undisclosed location. <laughs> And and I get my coffee. I go home and I play Counter Strike. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and he's a simple guy. Yeah, I'm a simple guy. Simple and that's why guy. that's why I didn't join in when when Nick was talking about the way the crypto bros lived because it's like that's me. That's me on the inside. <laughs> it's like the, all the all the ETH and the Dogecoin and the lack of furniture. That's that's me. And that's, what, and that's deep down. The same. So this podcast, our podcast, has been me slowly revealing to Aiden, who is seven years younger than me, that he is actually a, as broken as I am. Yeah, and but everything. Just, about him yet. is who I'm going to become, including yeah. this. It's all going. Imagine all going. You're, you're indoctrinating oh. it. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, sorry. sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. We'll blur that. We'll blur that in this episode. That's, that's actually not allowed in Japan either. That's... I took off my hat and Connor freaked out. He clutched his pearls. <laughs> <laughs> you, you are what I fear. <laughs> yeah, well, get get going on the pro piche. It'll help you <laughs> if you if you want to. I don't, there's no shame. I I'm, think you're I'm just taking those rhino things right now. Hoping yeah, it's gonna help. The rhino pills for your hoping boner. Gonna, no, the ha oh, I thought they were hair. Oh. <laughs> well, take the other ones too. Oh, okay. <laughs> you could take maybe if you take a, enough of them, they'll help with the air. Yeah, travel up the bloodstream. It's like when you, t when you drink like the monster, and it's like we have twenty thousand percent of your daily vitamin D eighteen. I, I, like, like I, I don't know what that is. Yeah, yeah. it's too. I much. hope I need twenty thousand percent of it because <laughs> I'm getting it. Should never be that much. <laughs> no. I don't care what. It, it is, is always like two thousand percent. It is concerning how much more than your daily percentage of. You can stack it. You stack it for the year. You drink your one <laughs> annual monster. Yeah. You actually. Don't need You're any banking. more vitamin D. Yeah, everyone knows that. Caveman science. quaking. <laughs> no, thanks, guys. It was really nice of you. To, you helped us out with our episode. Um, oh, yeah, man. This yeah. is, the studio's great. You guys are. I like how we just nice. got like our branding everywhere, even they though it's going on your yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they, they, they know. They know. They know already. They know. They know. Oh, our, our episode with Connor uh, just hit a million views. It's our highest viewed Fuck episode yeah. ever. Yeah. Hell, Hell yeah. yeah. Which is crazy. Represent. Couldn't man. have done it ourselves. We needed, yeah. we needed big we needed, bros. We needed help. Well, Jimmy couldn't. All right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? Isn't that crazy? Could solve blindness, but could he get a million views? I, I was saying that <laughs> when we were there. I was like, Jimmy didn't have what it takes. Yeah. You don't have what it takes. <laughs> you, you might see this and be actually offended. <laughs> no, he's. This he is, is the bait to get him to He'll come just back. Blame Ludwig for not marketing properly. It, I, I, because I genuinely, when I saw the episode, I did think like, yeah, it didn't look like you actually had him on. Like you were talking about him. Interesting. And then you had him yeah. on. I was like, wow. Yeah. Hey, so, shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> Nick made the but, thumbnail in the uh, title, so. If you cured um, blindness. <laughs> <laughs> he did cure. No, if you cleared blindness, he would have got a million views. Maybe. Not on if the, on not, the podcast. Not if Aiden did it. All right. 
All right. Uh, Thanks, guys. Uh, we'll catch you later. There's going to be a Patreon episode later on. These guys will not be on it because we'll be shooting it probably uh, back home. But uh, thanks so much. Oh, yeah. yeah. Thank you guys oh, a lot. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. Thanks for having us on. Of course. <laughs> on, <our own>. <laughs> <laughs> on your On your <laughs> set. It feels weird. On, on your <laughs> set, <laughs> after you took us out to dinner, <laughs> helped us find a bunch of stuff, <laughs> helped us find a set for the other episode. Bring it up more. Uh, why don't you? Yeah. So uh, just a little thumb. Yeah. Right. We'll, we'll, right. we'll call. We'll call yeah, in we'll LA. Call. We'll next, call. Next time in LA. We'll, we'll drive. Yeah. We'll drive. We'll, we'll drive. <laughs> we'll drive there. All right. See we'll be in touch. Wanna, do you guys want a sour pussy? So you are you brought something to divert do you want attention one? away. Like <laughs> like we're dogs. <laughs> oh, have a like, sour like, pussy. Like, you, like we're dogs and you threw a fucking tennis ball. To, I wanna, no, I get that it's I weird. Say so much. I get that these are weird. <laughs> First they're Ooh. sour and then they're sweet. <laughs> Fryler the creator. <laughs> 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 yeah, so does she not like you?